Hello, hello, everybody. I am live. Yes, YouTube says I'm live, so I am live. And we've got... Okay, I clicked to the... I clicked something. There we go. <laughs> so, sorry. I, uh... Yeah, sorry. I clicked over screen and I clicked on something and I got a different pop-up. Anyway, anyway, I'm live. Uh, we are here with our uh, on a budget guy. And we've got... What was the event that popped up? Uranium Fever. All right, that gives us a little bit of time. Uh, what is it today anyway? Explodes on death. Oh, perfect. Yeah, I don't want to do that with no armor. So we're going to go right to it. Let's do our gear and then I say hello to the chat people. Uh, let's start with our weapon this time. I think I have a plan after last time. If we start off with a bad weapon. Oh, geez. <laughs> that's actually really good. Um, damn. That's really good. That's, wow. Okay, that's really good. I'm full health, but that's still a really good weapon. So... God, do I want to go, do I want to try and do a, uh, damn. So I had a plan, but I don't know. Do I want to try and do a power armor today? Maybe I want to do power armor. Uh, let me think about that for a second. Oh, it's spinning. Hopefully the stream spinning isn't spinning for everyone else, but hello to Ram, Steve, James, Tyler, RHPS, Derek, off kilter, raccoon. Hello, hello. All right, so, yeah. Um, God, I don't know what to do. You know what, I'm going to go to the event. <laughs> Uh, actually, I need ammo, so let's go get ammo first. Uh, we'll go to our camp. I need ammo, because I don't have any. And then we'll go to the event. And while I'm at the event, I'll think about what I want to do. Because I could do power armor today. I mean, I could do put on stabilized. and Because using a heavy gun, since it's not anti-armor, without stabilized is kind of... But that that's actually a good... I mean, that's, mu that's a much better uh, weapon to use than... Uh, you know, then the Gatling Plasma that I got last time. So, 50 cal rounds. I have a few. Alright, so we'll start with this. We have no armor, so we'll probably die a lot. But, uh, yeah. There we go. Alright, this is... Wow, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, yeah, I don't know what to do. Should I do power armor? Should I not do power... I don't, I don't know. I mean, I could try... See, here's the thing. So, I could try and pull a melee weapon... And then not worry about it, because then this then this basically becomes a tagging weapon for events, which is fine. I mean, it's a good good for a tagging weapon. Um, okay, hello door. All right, there we go. We talked to the guy. This is a not a very busy server. It doesn't seem to be. Um, make sure I didn't. Okay, I don't know. What do people think I should do? I don't know what I should do. I can't really go low health. I mean, I can, but I have what rads so. That would make the low health theme kind of difficult. I mean, I could do low health with power armor. It wouldn't be that difficult. Gonna try a no sneak commando with vats. Looking to use the handmade. Do you think anti armor or quad is the way to go? Um, you're gonna do a no, uh, a no sneak commando. I think you'll be fine either way. Oh, see, I would do it the other way around. Honestly, quad for for bosses. I wouldn't do two. I don't really think you need two. I, I think you're fine either way. I mean, I use a quad. I mean, that's that's what my main character uses. And if I'm in an event, I'm basically not sneaking and it works great. So, hey, drinks. Welcome, welcome. So, I think either way is probably fine. I would think. Kind of a personal preference thing is, uh, yeah. I mean, honestly, pro actually, no, the more I think about it, probably quad. Carry 12 at a time. Yeah. I would say, I would actually say quad, actually. Um, and the reason for that is because you're not sneaky, you're going to get swarmed a lot more than you would if you're sneaking. And so, uh, I could do vats. Why not? So, since you're going to get swarmed a lot, this actually does all right. Since you're going to get swarmed a lot, reloading is kind of a pain, right? So, I would probably vote for quad. All right. Actually, I could use this as a VATS weapon. It's actually... <laughs> I could use this as a VATS weapon. Uh, I don't really have heavy gun perks, but God, maybe I'll just run this and... Uh, this is good for tagging. I think you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to pull regular armor. And... Uh, yeah, I don't really want to do low health because of the... I don't think I want to do low health. That'd be too much of a pain. So, yeah, I think I'll do regular armor. And... Uh, yeah, I don't have to worry about if my health drops, then my health drops and I just do more damage, so. Boom. I think that's what I'll do. But yeah, I think quad. That would be my vote. Quad for no for no sneaking. I think quad is uh 
Uh, okay, he's gonna blow up, and there goes my health. <laughs> I don't have Born Survivor. Somebody keeps dropping mines all over the place. Yeah, this is a good tagging weapon. Uh, it's really good. I mean, it's not necessarily suited for me, but it's definitely gonna be something somebody's gonna want. It is this. Bloodied explosive faster reload. That's what the 50 cal is. So it's, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, this will be something I'll I'd probably save it for my uh, my low health character. Although he doesn't really play heavy, heavy weapons, but still could be something to, yeah, right? One pull, that's all I've done so far. One pull from the purveyor. It's like, where's stuff like this when I do my purveyor videos? Although last time I did get a couple of cool, uh, good things. So yeah, I think I'll do another ranged weapon because even if it sucks, this one I think will get me through. Uh, and uh, yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Let's, uh, what food do I have going? All right, let's do our perfect bubble gum. Perfect bubble gum. I didn't restock on that, but uh, I guess I don't really need to heal. Is it back here? I don't know where it is. This works pretty well and for vats. I like the ammo capacity. I like 50, I like the 50 cal a lot more than the, uh, than the, uh, whatever it is. The one I had last week, the Gatling Plasma. Yeah, that reload is super, I don't even have a, uh, yeah, that reload's pretty quick. That's a good one, I like it. This'll, uh, this'll get me through. I don't think I have the right, uh, is that right? Hmm, all right. Mr. Epos, welcome, welcome. Okay, uh, okay. Plus, I should get a pile of ammo on this. I mean, this is pretty ammo efficient, too, so... Yeah, I think I'll pull regular armor for this. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Obviously not gonna get the armor penetration. What is the damage, anyway? Damage is 61, and I have no damage card, so I could... I could try and find some heavy, uh... Heavy cards. We'll see how it goes. What gives? It's day... It was daylight savings in the United States, uh... On Sunday, so... We're a little different than, yeah, we're, we'll be synced up. I don't know when it is for the rest of the world, but we're gonna, we'll be synced up event event again eventually, but yeah. It was daylight savings this past weekend, and it sucks. <laughs> I hate daylight savings time. It's like I can't fall asleep at night because it's too early. That's actually, yeah, that's pretty good. This, uh, this will work as a VATS weapon. I mean, it's not great, but I don't use gun foo, I don't think. Yeah, I'm not using Gun Fu, because I don't want to stay in VATS. I want to drop out, so. Next weekend. All right, so, okay. Yes, I agree, Drinks. FDST, for sure. Okay, so I can basically kill one thing, and eh, this will work. Because my plan today is to do the, uh, well, I need to finish off the Settler's, uh, you know, the Foundation quest line. The power Armor's kind of tempting. Maybe I'll pull the other, uh... I got you, maybe. There we go. Help the poor little level 19 guy. There's something... Nope, all right. Maybe I'll go power armor, though. That might actually be kind of helpful. Because probably stabilize would be... It's not power armor. Do I have... Let's see. I've got, do I have Stabilize? I think I have a rank, I do have one rank of Stabilize. I only have, see, I only have five perks for leveling, but I could easily shift some perks around from something to something, three points, and uh, do that. Maybe I'll pull another weapon and then, depending on what it is, maybe I'll go power the power armor out. Takes you five and a half months to adjust. Well, that's how it was for me. It just took me a few, the last few weeks, I've actually been sleeping really well. And it's like, oh, I'm finally used to the time, and then it switches up, and now it's just chaos again. Three Gatling, three Gatlings, UC Gatling, two Plasma Gatlings, two miniguns, three Hellstorms, Boomstick, Peacemaker. That's what you carry with you? That's a lot of weapons. Jeez. <laughs> That's, uh... I, uh... I'm more of a two weapon at a time, except for my melee character. My melee character carries more than two just because, and I keep reloading. Only because there's so many cool melee weapons and I just can't ever, and plus they don't weigh anything, so. I can't ever decide which one to go with. But like my regular commando, two, two weapons. That's what I carry. Uh, 
All right, where am I at? 670. I thought something was punching me. Adequate uranium volume extracted and, and I don't even know any of the... I wonder if I've scrapped any 50 cals. I probably haven't. So I probably don't know any mods for this because the heavy, the heavy barrel actually adds a lot of, I think, quite a bit of damage. I don't know where it is. Is it in here? Yeah. So the heavy barrel adds has a bit. So God, maybe I'll, I'll see if I can mod this. I'm horrible. Three weapons on him, then only ever uses one. Yeah, that's pretty much. Just transferred all rifles of bows to your alt. Oh wow. Eva rolled a decent Gauss rifle the other day, so you added to the... Ooh, I like Gauss rifles. Gauss rifles are fun. Yes, there was a comment on my Gauss video that I did... God, it was a while ago, eight or nine months ago. And the comment was that they don't work that... That my video was out of date and they're not that good anymore. And I'm like, well, I haven't used one in a bit. I got on, I'm like, I have no idea what they're talking about because it was great. I mean, I got on and it was fantastic, so... Care between six and 12, depending on the character. Only your new tune only has only three or four. Wow. Wow, it got, uh, like, whisper quiet in here all of a sudden. Okay, here we go. So, has everyone seen the beauty calendar yet? And uh, what do you think of it? Ah, okay, help. Oh, hey, I got, I got revived by something. Ah, let's run away. <laughs> Must have been a, uh, probably a, uh, ah, okay. It has that bug where you go down and you, uh, it starts shooting again. I probably had a scout bunner from last time. They work fine. They work great. Gas pistol. Yeah, gas was pistol's terrible. Some people like stimming. I guess. I mean, I don't know. It's. I mean, it was like, well, maybe it's his build, whatever. But I'm just like, I just. I just tested it, and it was. It worked great. I was able to one tap stuff without without charging. So wow, put you all the way back here. Oh yeah, that sucks. <laughs> all the way back here. Good thing I re refreshed my sleep right before, right before the stream. Let's go in and loot. Let's, uh, hopefully we can get some ammo. I didn't really spend that much. I don't know what I started with. Maybe a thousand or so. Okay. All right. So I'm over encumbered from something. Should be at legendaries in here. Okay, now I'm over a thousand rounds. So what do we drop? Something good? No. Nope. Oh, minor gauntlet. I've I've picked up and scrapped enough of those. So we are just going to make the rounds. And I want everyone to know I did a lot of looting. A lot of looting because I went and where did I go? Oh, that's probably me. That was my loot bag. Oh, that's all I got. Okay. Let's scrap this, get out of here, and get the rest of our gear. I'm still kind of on the fence. I don't think I want to run power armor. I think I'm kind of having fun just doing this. So, Pablo, hello, hello. How much DP costs for uh, 50 cal? It's like 50, I think. I think it's. Uh, I think the AP cost is 50, as far as I can remember. I'll look in a second, but I think it's 50. Gas rifle's cool. There's even an IRL version of it, non-explosive. Oh, okay. Hey, perf. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, I think it's 50. I'll look, but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure the heavy guns are pretty all are like 50. They're I think they're all of them are 50. So Gauss cannons on battleships. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I don't need from these kind of events. I don't need shotguns. I don't need assault rifles. I don't need uh There we go. Now we're underway. All right, let's go to People are hitting each other. Okay, let's go here first, dump our stuff, and then we'll go to the purveyor and finish our load. I think I'm gonna go regular armor though. <clears throat> you want a rail gun? What would you do with a rail gun? I mean, in this game, it'd be cool. You could put them on your ship in um, Starfield, there's that. Okay, we'll put that away, that away. I've already turned in some script, as you can see. Let's do that. And that. And let's see here. What are we? Chest piece. I'm gonna hold off on the uh, the party pack for now. Drop those. All right, let's go sell some stuff. Try to get the show on the road. Hey, Brian. 
High output weapons have low AP costs, but low output weapons have high AP costs. Yeah, well, and the heavy guns are not usually, they're not intended for VATs. So they're not going to have a, uh, they're going to be expensive. That's something I'll, I was going to check, though. First of all, let's look at the AP cost. Oh, it's only 30? Really? All right. That's way less than I thought it was. I thought it was 50. Okay, I was wrong. It's only 30. I thought it was 50, so. A railgun, yeah. A railgun, you can you can put them on your ships in Starfield. I don't think I know any mods for this. I probably haven't scrapped any 50 cows. I know where you can find one kind of loose in the world. Yeah, I don't know any mods. Yeah, there's a heavy, I think it's a heavy barrel. I think that's the one you want. Oh, appearance? What do I have here? Presidential, ooh, that's very fancy. Ooh, let's do this one. Presidential paint. Little eagle on the side. All right, we'll do that. Okay, let's go back to the purveyor and uh, get some stuff. Get some more stuff. You were right. I was wrong. I thought it was 50. So, same as Enclave Plasma. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, same as uh, Rail Gun is what gas weapons are in real life. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. All right, here we go. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, Vault Steel. That'd be awesome. That'd be a good thing. Let's do let's do another range weapon. If it's a if it's another heavy gun, then it'll be tempting to do uh, power armor. But let's do another range weapon. Suppressor's Dragon. It's it's got reload speed. I mean, I could actually use this. I mean, it's still even though the other the other things aren't very good, I could still use that. Okay, that's not, it'll break though really quickly. So that's, that's not the best thing, but I could use it. I probably won't, but I can use it. Okay, legendary armor, let's do right here. So five pieces of armor. Do you have the heavy body? No, I don't have any, I don't know any mods. I, I don't have any mods, so do, 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 do. yeah, it's one, it's quarter after one in the afternoon here. All right, legendary armor number one. Zealots with, oh, AP regen is good. Zealots is not that great. Uh, and it's at least it's heavy leather, so there's that. Okay, so that's one. Number two will be a regenerating marine. Okay, so we'll get healing, which doesn't really work with bloodied, but that's okay. We're, we're just winging it here. Uh, plus one intelligence, whatever. Is this other one a left leg? Oh, so I have two left legs. Of course I do. So there's that. I'll probably go with uh, Zealots then. And we got a wood right arm, another AP regen. Okay, I hate cloaking, but whatever. <laughs> so, so far, just give me a torso. That's that's where you get the, give me like a heavy combat torso. Vanguards, Raider, le another left leg. So that's three left legs for you keeping track at home. Uh, modded normally, it works at around 36. Uh, uh, what works at around 36? You mean the AP cost goes up? Is that what you're saying? Uh, let's see here. Three left legs. Okay, this sucks so far. Uh, one, wait, one, two, three. Okay, one more. And that's it. That's it for the day. Chameleon, heavy robot, uh, left arm. Well, at least it's not another left leg. So, all right, what do we have here? Not good. Okay, so left arm, right arm, and then three left legs. So I have a Vanguard's, which is AP regen. I may go with Vanguard just because it'll give me the most. Then I've got, this is AP regen, but this will give me, I mean, normally I'm not a fan of Vanguard, but uh, let's see, what does that do? 101, 73, 66, 75. All right, we're gonna go Vanguard. Ugh, I hate Vanguards, but I think that's just what we're gonna have to do. All right, let's see about modding this stuff. See what we could do with that. Yeah, it's gonna be kind of a funky loadout today. <clears throat> Left legs for days, yes. As you have 20 power armor frames and they only have left legs on them. Uh, let's see here. Standard painted. That is, that's 10 extra. That's good. And, oh, ultralight. I could do ultralight. Hang on. Let's, let's swap on some armor here. Since I could do that stuff and I have the materials. Hey, Andy. Welcome, welcome. Last script surplus. Yes, I'm sure. Okay, so we've got uh, ultralight. And uh, let's go with... Uh, Ooh, let's go with, let's go, let's be a Tony the Tiger today. Let's do that. Uh, let's see, wood arm, oh, and I can't mod it. That's the problem with wood is you can't, other than shrouded. <clears throat> Can I do paint? Um, yeah, the paint on this is kind of dumb. <clears throat> mm, let's go free states, right? Since it's the free states people that give you the shrouded plan. Oh, that's bad. 
And what was the other one? Raider leg, which Raider doesn't have paint. So I really didn't, uh, lead lined. Sure, why not? And yeah, paint isn't a thing on this one. So, so our final, where, where are we at? 120 and 87. And we're kind of doing rough stuff today too. At least that's the plan. So we'll see. Let's put the dragon over here. I don't, I just don't, uh, I don't see me using this much. But we'll see how it goes. The 50 cal is probably going to be doing all the work. What is the uh, ammo situation anyway? Whoops. Hang on. I'm just learning how this... Uh, the, God, there's a lot of things. Okay, 1,600 rounds. Yeah, I'll probably... I probably should get some ammo for that. Uh, let's put away our armor. There's that. Okay. Two pepper... Oh, two pepper shakers as well. Shrouded is actually good. It's good for sneaking, but my guns aren't. So I'm probably sneaking isn't going to be a thing today, probably. So I have two noisy guns. Got to go. All right, Raccoon, thanks for stopping by. I would think so. It should help. I mean, I start with 1,000. Plus, I have that mutated party pack, so I can get more from that. Probably another 100 or so. Um, is there an event popping up? Project Paradise. I don't care about this. This isn't... Someone's there? There's two people there? Really? I don't, I don't know about Project Paradise. I'm still trying to figure out my loadout. Oh, someone, and someone's probably going to launch it. A nuke in two years. Um, there's a 50 cal. Do I have the scout camp? Okay, there's this 50 cal on the road. Let's see about, uh, let's see if I can get lucky. I'm gonna go for that 50 cal. We'll see how it goes. I'll check Project Paradise in a second, but I wanna grab this 50 cal that's in the road and scrap it. Cause that heavy, heavy frame or whatever, heavy barrel, that can make some difference. So it's in the back of this, hang on. It's down, okay. I can't move, Every it's like the road is made of glue or something. It's trying to eat me. So if we go here, yeah, so we've got, how much AP regen do we have? A bit, usually there's a raider right here. I knew it. Okay, that works. <laughs> that works pretty well. Obviously raiders are weak, but still, that works. Uh, yeah, maybe I want to re rejigger some perks around to kind of get some more damage because I could because I could add in demo expert. What I don't want to have to do is repair this though. So, um, yeah, I don't know. There's a 50 cal south of Hemlock Holes on the Jeep. You mean this one right here? <laughs> this is the one we're talking about. This one on this Jeep. There we go. Way set. Oh, and 50 cal rounds. Nice. And there we got a nuke. So that's a thing. Now that could be a... Uh, oh, look at that. Baby's first nuke. Awesome. Um, What do we have here? We only have one person doing that now. So yeah, that's not a thing. All right, let's go here. We'll scrap it. Maybe we can learn a mod. There's another one? Oh, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, it's over by where the grafted monster and the snallygasters are, right? Over there. Five ranks of gunsmith and however many points you got left. Well, I don't have any points is the thing. I have five intelligence. So that's that's the thing. So, and I don't really have a lot of perks to... I didn't learn anything. I don't really have a lot of perks to mess around with is the problem. I've only got five level ups. So it's not like I could do a lot. So I could do... Um... Yeah, I can't really do... Well, let's see. I could take... No. I mean, I don't really... I don't really have... I don't really have room to play, is the thing. So, yeah. I can't really do much. Let's see. What would I do with that? Yeah. I'm kind of stuck. I'm kind of stuck with what I got. I can't really do much. So... Flat style from, from Hemlock Holes. All right. Perk machine. Well, yeah, but I, where am I going to move them from is the problem. So, I mean, I could, well, then if I go to rank one, see, the problem is if I, if I take out perks here, I don't have points to be able to put in like, yeah, I don't have the points is the problem. I only have five level ups, so I would need like more, more. So I'm just going to go with what I got for now. And, uh, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're just going to go with what we got and hope for the best. Uh, I was gonna see about who sells that 50 cal plan. Is it the brotherhood? It's the brotherhood, right? I think that sells the 50 cal the other brotherhood. I think it's the brotherhood that sells it I may want to just craft some 50 cals at this point uh, Let's see notes 
Thirty-four sixty-five. I mean, I have the caps. I could probably craft a few and get the heavy because I'm pretty sure the fifth the heavy is learned from. Let's do that. Uh, do I have hard bargain? I have one rank of hard bargain. Um, we'll do that. I'm gonna change this to a charisma team very quickly and then change it back. That'll save some. Wait, role play. Move ranks. Yeah, I'm moving up from where? That is the thing. I don't really have a spots where I want to give up. So let's see. Do I have a great mentats? I don't. All right. We're just going to go with it here. I'm going to run with what I got. If you don't like it, you don't have to watch. How about that? Beer grape. Yeah, I don't have great mentats or beer. Oh, I forgot about the... Uh... Let's see, let's go take off our bargain, put on tenderizer, change us back to a casual team. All right. And colossal problem, colossal problem. There we go. I want, but I am doing a crit build. The thing is I'm gonna, I want to do a crit build because that's where my damage is gonna come from. So yeah, any suggestions how to get UC Gatling plan? Uh, cranberry bog events. I mean, that's uh, yeah, cranberry bog events are where you get it. <laughs> that's it has a small chance to drop, but that's where you get it from. Do do your dailies, like do the dailies in cranberry bog. That's that's you know that's what I would do. All right, was I close enough to get any any loot here? Um, I can. What I'm gonna do is scrap some and do it that way. In fact, let's learn this note. I can, but that can get really expensive. Buying weapons, I mean, that could really eat through your, uh, uh, that could eat through your stuff really quick. I should have quite a bit of materials at this point, because I haven't crafted anything at all, and I have farmed quite a bit. So after this event goes, because I should have a lot of screws and stuff, especially after this event. So yeah, that's what I'll do it. Level three saves. Yeah, level three saves as well. Are you on PC? Are you on, uh, what, do you, what platform are you on? Because it's possible someone in here has got an extra one to trade or give away. Probably not give away because they're they're really rare. Yeah, basically just do anything you can in the Cranberry Bog. Do your dailies, do events, do pick level three safes. I mean, there's a safe right uh, here. There's one in the flooded train yard, which I didn't show in my video because I was able, I, never able to, to verify it. I mean, I know it can drop a heavy gun, but I could never get or plan it, rather. So there's one just like right inside there. And then there's one in here, of course. There's other ones around. I think there's some in Watoga as well. So yeah, basically if it happens with the Cranberry Bog, do it. That's your best chance. The drop rate's really low though. I mean, it's, uh, let's see, what is the, it's weird that, it, that it's so low. Uh, let's see. Why isn't it showing up here? Um, oh, Ultrasight. No, that's not it. Ultrasight, Gatling. It's Ultrasight, Gatling, Laser, not Plan, right? Yeah. I was saying Gatling, Plasma. It's Ultrasight, Gatling, Laser. Uh, let's see here. The drop rate is, yeah, it's 0.1%. Since it's violence, it has a 0.5%. So that's one you want to do for sure. But yeah, the drop rate's just stupid. So... Yeah, any it, yeah, it should it's any event in the Cranberry Bog has a chance. And and dailies are considered events. So things like uh Coppa Squatter, that that would actually count as an event, so you have a chance to get it from that. So yeah, do things like census violence, uh uh what's the other one? The well do well, not monster mash, but you know, it's a trap will spawn down here sometimes. Uh yeah, so that's it. That's what you could do. Scorched Beast Queen, yeah, well, that's it. Scorched Earth. You have a chance to get it from that. So it's, uh, it's things. Where are we at here? Okay, what is my uh, situation with food? I don't have any food going. All right, well, I'm only doing... Um, spoiled vegetables. Oh, that's my, uh, that's my AP regen. Okay, I need to refresh my... Uh, I can do cam meats, too. I need to get some more... Um, what is it? Company tea from my uh, from my vendor or from my account after this. So hey, Dar Silver, welcome. Used to buy a couple hundred for the same location. 
Oh, treasure maps? Yeah, I don't know if you can get them from treasure maps or not. I didn't get, I mean, when I did all my maps, I didn't get one, but I know there's lots of things you can get that I didn't, so. A billion bog maps for 10 caps each, yeah. Duping, if you see yellow dot on the map in the bog, just go do it. Yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. Can drop a weapon also. Oh, you can, you can get it from the maps? All right. I mean, I would expect it. I mean, the map, I mean, I think usually when it says from events for a particular region, basically it's part of that drop full for that reason. So region, so anything that drops stuff in the region should uh, do it. All right, let's see how this goes. But try and be ammo efficient, so. All right. Yeah, my armor is uh, a little, let's get back a bit. Let's zoom it out. All right, let's see what we could do with critical hits to the head. <laughs> AP cost is, is uh, done. I mean, the damage isn't, uh, it's about what I'd expect. Obviously, if I was running stabilized. And he's to do his thing. Caused me to run away. Treasure maps is the only place for dense plans. Is it? Well, you can also get them from, like, the dense plans have a chance to spawn at the vendors, too. Like the Watoga vendor. Because that's where I got dense. Uh, I can't remember which one it was. I think it was the metal one. Because that's one of those ones that's really rare. I think my dense metal plan came from a, a vendor. It was one of them. I don't remember which one, but it was one of them. Yeah, no sneaking for me today. I should have gone power armor. But I like using bats, so... <laughs> this is this is like a total spray of prey weapon, but... Uh, do damage on me, it only makes me stronger. Which is true. Searching for the dance plan. Well, there's one I found in a player. Actually, Genkai found it in a player vendor, and he's like, come and, uh, I can't remember if he bought it for me and I paid it, or I bought it from him, or if, uh, I, I, he told me about the camp and I bought it. But one I found, there was, because there was two of them that I was trying to find. I think one was metal, and the other was marine. One of them I got from another player vendor, and one of them I got from a Toga vendor. But yeah, it was a, it was a search for sure. Grafton vendor, not the train stations, has dense plans from time to time. Okay. Grafton vendor. Oh, you mean the one that's inside? Uh, oh, in that one area. Okay. I, I wouldn't even think to check him for plans. Good to know. Does he have all dense plans? Because some some are uh, kind of confined to certain areas. So, yeah, my damage isn't much. Although they're really tanky, so I shouldn't feel feel bad about that. Hey, Admiral. <laughs> I appreciate that. Yep, this is me. This is how I look. This is not an avatar. If it is, I chose poorly. Oh, this guy's going down quick. All right. Oh, someone's in trouble. I'm coming. I'm co Oh, never mind. It was a fake out. We're just spraying and praying for looting purposes. Screws are probably the number one thing I'll need to craft a bunch of, because I'm going to craft some 50 cals. Crafted scrap. I mean, there's only a couple of mods. They should be pretty easy to learn. From doing it in the past, I don't remember having to craft that many. So. Hey, Viticus. Welcome, welcome. Responder bot. Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't even... I wonder if you can get the dance like any of them. That's kind of curious. Although at this point, I'm not really looking for them. I got them, and I'm not going to try and repair. I mean, I basically got them. They're on armors I don't even use. I basically got them so that I could just have all of the plans for that character, which I still don't have all the plans. There's some I'm missing. Yes. Yeah, Flamer would have been fun. I wouldn't mind that. Be a little harder to stock with ammo. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> come on. Sometimes those stim packs, they take, uh... Yeah, fireproof doesn't, uh, doesn't protect you from the embers at all.
Yeah, so I've got, uh, if things go according to plan, I'll have, because I gotta do the robots, that's the next quest. Is the, uh... Alright, I'm trying, I'm trying, trying to get there, but I'm, uh, staggered. Alright. Alright, let's go kill Earl, let's loot him, and, uh, where's his body? Over there? Alright. Stay away from the fire, I'm not used to, uh... The armor's so bad. Assassin's Broadsider, awesome. And I'm over encumbered. Oh, great. Uh, let's see here. Weapons, missile launcher, mole miner gauntlet. It's all right. Okay, good. Got rid of just enough. One last loot. There we go. All right, let's get out of here. Hey, Pete. Uh, remember screws being a nonstop problem when you were starting out? Yeah, same. Basically, until this event came to town, screws were a thing. And then once, once this event showed up, it was just... We don't care about screws anymore. Unlimited. Yeah, my main character's got, I don't know, well over 100,000. Which was the goal, right? Like, that that was like a thing I was... Okay, come on. I was trying to do was to get over 100,000 screws just because I thought it'd be fun to say, I have 100,000 screws. Fate Commander Shepard reporting. All right. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I definitely need to go back to my camp, Company T. I'm out of Company T. What I had spoiled. So let's get some caps. This desk fan and... Uh, ah, okay. Camera hates me, so we're just going here, here, here. Wait, I don't want to get over encumbered again. Alright, let's go this. Got our hazmat suit. Ready to go. Alright. Craft lowest cheap. Yeah, I think the lowest is level 30, I want to say. Bulk screws well and acid, right? So this gave you screws and acid. So it made those roll those runs into Lucky Hole not a problem because you could actually smelt all of the all of the stuff. So Let's see, where can we go? We can't go anywhere, we're right in the middle. Oh, I saw this out of the corner of my eye, the weeds, and I thought it was like cricket legs. Like, there's not a cave cricket here. Perfect combination. Ready for a nuke zone. Run, coward, run, exactly. Never buy a bolt from vendors, now I'll use, yeah, exactly. And, all right, we're just gonna put our tent down. Let's uh, scrap a bunch of stuff. Scrap that, and let's get out of here. Cursed harpoon gun, yes it is. All right, let's go to camp first. I need company tea, and I know I'll forget. Hey, Ramos, happy Friday to you. Acid was never your biggest problem because you didn't craft gunpowder or smell, yeah. Me either. But I didn't play with fallout, fall I mean, I played without fallout first for the first six months of the game. So for me, I couldn't store all that stuff anyway. Let's see, power, power, that's power. That's uh, that, 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 that. Um, all right. Cursed harpoon gun. Uh, let's see, I do have a weapon bench, so that works. And I leveled up again, which could help. Let's uh, do this. Do that, let's see, harpoons, cannonball. Let's just store this stuff. Sass's broadside, or cursed harpoon gun. That, uh, let's see, company T, there we go. Eat some company T, let's clean this out. Ah, I'm used to having more, uh, more benches. I never, I never made any more benches. Okay, so, um, uh, food. Company T, there we go, that's better. Uh, most of your caps selling gunpowder seems to go fast. Yeah, gunpowder accum that's which is weird. I have accumulated so much gunpowder since it started going in the scrap machine. It's crazy. I never I never saved it before, but now now it's just I mean thousands and thousands of gunpowder. Tired of waiting until the twenty six for the new updates. So you're you're so impatient and starve for more content. Yeah, scoreboard will keep you busy. First year and a half you play without first. Oh wow. I would never expect gunpowder to be a thing. Okay, I do not have super dupe. Oh, do I want to? Well, let's see what I could do. I don't know if I want to waste perk points on super duper. We'll see. It's a it's a question of perk points versus um versus. Oh, it's level twenty five. Okay, so what can I do? Ten gear, seven oil, springs. Let's cat. Let's craft like six of them. Seven. Let's do seven. All right. Let's hope I get the the plan I'm looking for. 
Okay, I learned something, but uh, save and sound got in the way. I learned a mod. Hopefully it's the one I want. There's only two, so I got a 50-50 chance. Oh, heavy barrel. I got it. Okay, yeah, the damage goes up uh, 10%. So it's not massive, but uh, that's fine. I got, the, I got what I wanted. So I got a little bit there. Yeah, just... I want to do the critical hits, so... Because I think... Because here's the thing. I could do less critical hits and then put point... You know, add in some, uh, like, heavy gunner stuff there. Critical hits will do more damage, right? So... Yeah, I think I'm just going to leave it. We're just going to leave it. Hey, Kylie. Welcome, welcome. Get the crafting cost magazine. Okay, I'll go out and find that magazine. Sell for one cap, but if you put 4,500 out, it'll sell in a few hours, sometimes usually all in one sale. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. That's crazy. Uh, okay. Dropping. All right. What do we have? Was there an event? Oh, safe and sound. Uh, I like safe and sound. Other people like safe and sound as well. We're not doing very well with our questing. Hmm. All right, there's already people here. Let's talk to Vera. Let's talk to Vera. Get the show on the road. So. Yep. There we go. Watch your dunk. Got that. All right. So let's see. What's our ammo situation look like anyway? So I start with 1,600. Yeah, I'm already at 3,200 rounds. <laughs> Do I have any plans? No. All right. So all right, we're doing okay. Sleepy. You're like one of the dwarves. One of the seven dwarves. Okay. Oh darn! Looks like the circuit breakers have blown. Mind patching them up so Kai can get the repellers running? Just follow the cable from the generator. Got that one fixed. What about this one in here? Needs fixing. I helped. Event slow quest way down. Like I like I said, I think I said this on a previous stream when I'm questing on like a regular character. I will very often just go to a private server and just do it that way and ignore events. Lately, jeez, the last, I don't know, three or four times I've been on a private server, eviction notices popped up. And I'm never on a character that like, earlier today I was on doing script with this character. Obviously I'm not gonna try it solo eviction notice with this character. But I had, I think I did two of them yesterday and who had six circuit breakers to a circuit? I don't know. Pneumon oh, pneumonia. That sounds rough. Everyone? I don't know. Circuit breaker for each point of power generation. Uh oh, now we're talking electrical talk. I am not an electrician. I mean, that's pretty good. That's accuracy, 95%. That works. We'll see how this goes as things go on. Shame, shame we're not on the same platform. PC player here. I'm I'm on PC. Hack it. I use an Xbox controller, but I'm on PC. A circuit breaker is for uh is to keep from frying the wires, isn't it? Isn't it that was I mean it's or from frying components or from Yes, isn't it to basically to prevent fire? Isn't that the point? So you don't have too much power going through the wire? Yep, I'm just a controller pleb, exactly. You gotta hurry. Yeah, if you're up, feel free to join. Feel free to join. I am on, you can see on the lower left there, Wiggle Wanderer. That is the IGN for this account. Thanks. It is a uh, prospector hat. I picked it up somewhere and decided I wanted to just switch it up today. It kind of fits. I mean, it's completely out of place along with everything else I have, so... Stop one component for frying an entire circuit, yeah. Plasma caster, that's what I needed. Unfortunately, I do not know the caster, uh, the plasma caster plan, so that couldn't happen. The black version? Oh, there's a black version? I didn't know there was a black version. Probably switch to PC if you could take your characters with, yeah. That's the thing, it's like, uh, yeah. That's that's the rub right there. 
you're kind of invested. And that's what they count on, right? You get invested in the platform and... <laughs> black cowboy hat. Well, I've got a black cowboy hat. I didn't know there was a black pros prospector hat. I mean, I've got, I've got black... I have black cowboy hats. A Paul Bear's hat? Oh, okay. Okay. Was it a atomic shop thing or is it? Because uh, I don't remember ever seeing that one. PS crash is too much. We are stuck there. Ugh. Wrath of John. Hello, hello. Radioactive bear. Uh oh, I hear a. No. Thought I heard him. I mean, I heard him, but I thought it meant he was here, but he's not. Wait. Oh, there he is. Wow. Wow. Thank you very much, Kylie. That's very nice of you. Wow. Cool. Thank you very, very much. Thank you, thank you. That was nice. Welcome all these uh, Gareth and Ramed and Gibson and Colin and Mark. Welcome, welcome. Thank you very much, Kylie. That's very nice of you. Now you have to recover from your pneumonia. Blackwoods are hard to find. Now I'm kind of curious. Oh, now I'm kind of curious. Okay. It's like now I just want to see when I hear stuff like that, it makes me want to just like drop everything and go looking for the black prospector hat. <laughs> Even though I probably would never wear it. It's like, I got to go looking for that because you know, it's a thing to find. And scavenger hunting is like my favorite thing to do in this game. Hey Dan, welcome, welcome. Oh, gee. <laughs> Still no icon. Yeah, the, um... Oh, okay, yeah, because it does show both. Pretty hard on us collectors. Yes, it is. Well, you know, the people that missed out on the mass, they're going to have another chance at the mass because, you know... Like, I'm really happy that we got... Uh, it's nice to see a, ca a calendar, but looking at the calendar... So, it covers three months, right? Like, the next season is three months long. Over the course of three months, uh, one month of that is going to be covered by special events. Just way too many. So, found the Black Prospector's hat somewhere at White Springs. All right. Oh, maybe bought it? Jolene? No, I don't I don't sing. I, I, I like my audience. Uh, really? Did I not get anything to... Uh, I like my audience, so I'm not going to sing at them. That would be mean. <laughs> you can you can sing if you want, but I'm not singing. Okay, so we've got that. Uh, let's see, I got a plan. I probably have a bunch of food to, not food, but a bunch of meat. We're gonna go to the. Uh, we're gonna go and uh, get our asses kicked at the. Uh, um, at the robot factory. Ugh, that's gonna that's gonna be rough. I think. We'll see how it goes. Oh, I have legendaries too. No, I won't torment you. Another chance to wonder how you could do that many events and get nothing out of it. Well, the thing that's rough is like, like the thing about the Mothman one, like there's the Mothman event doesn't have anything good, right? There's no good rewards from that. So unless you just love the event, which I do not, I hate that event. I've always hated that event. So two weeks of that is just two weeks of me ignoring, ignoring events, except on streams. On streams, I'll do the events. But other than that, I'll, I generally just ignore them. Okay, so we're going Robco and uh, hoping for the best. One black variant can be found at the White Spring Resort across from the main entrance on the front porch of one of the locked houses. Oh, okay, interesting. All right, I'll have to do I'll have to do that uh, at some point. Can't wait for people to be toxic again when Foshnot comes back. Yeah, that happened. Well, that's always going to happen. There's always going to be people that are they're going to do something, and always other people that are going to be upset with it. It's just how it is. I mean, it's not just in video games. It's not just in this video game. It's not just in video games. It's in uh, life as well. People always are upset at what other people. <laughs> I appreciate it, Kylene. However often, I appreciate it. Any 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 support is welcome. Thank you very much. That's very nice of you. Lead on. I've got you did a winter mass this time, but no glowing. I got a I got a one this time too, but it was on my character that I was that I was just. Uh, I was just using to farm it, so I didn't even keep the character, so I ended up losing that mask because I couldn't, you know, you can't transfer it over. What rads really helped you with that problem with, uh... Oh, there's new rewards perf- Yeah, but are they good? I mean, that's the thing. I mean, 
So really the rewards in the event now, I don't really, I mean, I have them all. I don't care about any of them though. I don't use the outfits or the packs or it just, yeah. It, the rewards just kind of meh. Oh, the nukes. Yes. More Mothman or invaders. I would like to have more invaders. I like invaders. That's the one I don't mind having for two weeks. Uh, meat week for two weeks is painful just because it just kills the game. Because all you end up with is, um, I guess I can talk and do this too, right? I could try. I'm going to do this in first person though. And we are going to try and run. Let's see. Oh, we just need to go right. Uh, no, this isn't where we go. Right? This is. Uh... There we go. All right. That'll do that. Oh, it is right here. There is a uh, robot right here. Did I get it? Okay. Yep. There's a robot. We're just going to ignore the robot. Okay. Okay. Down here, this is the only way to do this. I can't, otherwise I'll be in here forever. Because they'll just endless, endlessly respawn. And that just isn't going to do me any favors. Although, if this is an ammo box, I'll take this. iBot's going to follow me around. Oh, no. It's not. It's different iBots. See, I'm glad the critical hits. Uh, critical hits are nice. Let's see here. Take the brain. There we go. Probably a bear. Hello, Meat Week and Fosh, now the two worst. Well, the problem with Meat Week is is the prime cuts because that's running constantly. So number one, nobody does any other events at all. And then you have, um, and then you have uh, server just gets really laggy really quickly because of all that crap that's laying on the ground. So yeah, it's, it's a combination of just really, really uh, bad news, I guess. All right, this will work. I mean, my AP runs out, but it comes back pretty quickly. I just got to make sure I keep on top of company T and uh, do this. And the fact that I don't have to reload last week, you know, it was the opposite of last week, right? Where last week I had the, the, he's talking. Uh, <laughs> let's see. So pH of what? pH is seven and something is. Okay, I, I heard a door close behind me or open behind me. 41. And three. And start. All right, easy peasy. They're both lots of fun, but only one week at a time. Two weeks is just too much. I agree with that. Two weeks is too much. All right, so now I need to go facilities wing. So that's, uh, okay, around here. There's an Assaultron. Let's uh, pretend like we don't see it. <laughs> just, we're just gonna pretend like we don't see it. Now, is this a, uh, does it have a turret in here? We want that. Yes, all right. Ah. <laughs> I should be using, okay, come on. I should be using uh, Board Survivor. That's what I should be using, Board Survivor today. I'll swap that out. Since I'm not sneaking. Since I'm not sneaking, I'm going to swap in Born Survivor. But let's do this. We'll do that there. Add the brain. Talk to him. Do the thing. Yes? All right, perfect. Perfect, perfect. All right. Use your personal word during meet week and do events you like solo. Ah, oh, okay, that's a good way to do it. Yeah, if I want to do quests, I definitely don't do them on public servers during meet week because the servers just, they, they run so crappy. So, and honestly, meet week doesn't have stuff that I care about a whole lot in terms of rewards because I have everything. And although maybe there's new ones this time around, I don't know. Yeah, if this was vampire, okay, let's, uh, there we go. If this was Vampire, that would have been good. Yeah, so I'm going to put in Born Survivor after this. Because I'm definitely going to need it. Not sneaking, and my armor sucks. With Meat Week, there's something to do constantly. There is. I mean, it's good for XP farming. And I noticed there's only one double XP. It's right at the beginning, though. Like, the like it's in the like second or third week of this because it's the same so like the weekend the uh, amazon tv comes out so that's on the 11th of april so the tw the 11th through the that weekend is double xp as well so it's a good fallout weekend you can binge the tv show and uh, i guess they don't want you doing that it's like i want to binge the tv show i don't want to be playing getting double xp 
All right, come on. I can do this. There we go. And now he's done, right? Because it's usually just two waves. All right, this went uh, much easier than I thought. I mean, our hero back there is getting his ass kicked, but uh, that's okay. Let's take this and that. The ransack bunker. So I went there um, yesterday or the day before. I don't know. I went there, so I didn't have to go there today to start the quest. And I and I cleaned that place out. Everyone would have been so happy. But that's why I go there off a of stream, so I have time to loot it. Potato salad, pepper shaker, giant hammer, plus it's mods. Yeah, I still have all those. So <laughs> Star Wars Battlefront Classic Collection had a broken launch. All right. Uh, wait a minute. What did I miss? They can't new cook out or push people off the drums. That's true. They can't. Meat week at least. Uh, let's see. Endless horde of meat to be gathered. It's lots of meat and it's lots of XP. I mean, that's the thing. It's a lot of XP if you want to do it for that. Like, if you just wanted to farm it and not even care about the event, just kill stuff on... Yeah, it's so much experience you can get. Where water cooler... Water cooler comes from... Uh, no, that comes from one of the pails or one of the gifts or something. But yeah, the uh, it's tato salad, pepper shaker, the the um, tenderizer, those plans. And there's a Chally, Chally backpack, I think. Saving up Nuka grenades for double XP. There you go. Mutate a, no, it's not. It's from, uh, it's either from, it's either from gifts or pails or the spooky bags. It's one of those. I don't remember which, but it's one of those things. 20 pepper shakers, figure out how to move them. Oh, okay. From P, oh yeah, PS4 to P PC. You need witchcraft for that. Alien invasion? I don't think so. I don't think that's a why. I don't think that it comes from that. I don't think so. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. You got a bug where the plant isn't marked as known, even though you had two copies and read one. Well, that happens with a lot of things. Server space for fourteen hundred players. Ten k pre-purchase players. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> I have no idea. Was playing the collection last night with friends. We were fighting the AI and they were teleporting your shots registered only half the time. Why do I feel we're follow we're talking about a different game now? All right. Sergeant Rack Kind of lost. Interesting choice of words. SW Battle Oh, that collection. Okay, got gotcha, you, got gotcha. you. I heard the collection. I mean, I hear collecting and I think of Fallout. So, yeah. Follow through. Holiday gifts. All right. I knew it was from one of those things. All right, so we've got that. Let's go talk to Paige. Oh, wait. Real, oh, Real Blast. I was going to say, if that was uh, the other one, I'd go do it. But Real Blast, I don't care about. All you're going to get from that are, like, uh, pieces of uh, scout armor. Which isn't legendary. And I couldn't use anyway. All you right. Really know that whole over -deliver mantra, don't yes, you? I do. We got the group. No, that's it. Just let me know. All right. So, oh, and I got old guard again, which I already have one. I don't know if I'll save both of these. Oh, my rep. Is it friendly? Is my rep friendly? Oh, Bane. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, friendly. Okay. I know where we're going next. We're going here. Where we already are, but we're just going outside. I'm going to get me the, uh, the pack for the uh, food. It's not going to make a lot of difference, but it will be some difference. Friendly rep is when you can buy the, uh, yeah. And I guess Minerva in the next go round is going to have, she'll have the, um, what is it? Whoops. That's not what I wanted. She'll have something. She'll have the uh, chemist mod. This character won't be around then though. Next time, next, not when she's back, nah, I think it's when she's back next, because it'll be after, yeah, it'll be like after the new season starts, so this character will be gone. All right, doofus. Yeah, if you don't see him where he's supposed to be, he'll be right here. Uh, let's see here. Uh, grocer's backpack mod, thank you very much. All right, notes, let's learn that. Let's go and clean up our inventory. And then go find Lou. Stupid, stupid. Oh, no. We'll have a mutate event already. Wow. It took me an hour to do that qu that event that only takes 10 minutes. <laughs> that's that's kind of how it goes. I don't know if I'll be able to finish the entire Raider quest slide today. We'll, we'll, we'll try. 
We'll try. Let's see. Got that, that, stuff, and things. And again, the mods aren't showing up for me, so... Yeah, my, uh... My pop-up stuff just isn't, uh, isn't working. Okay, old guard. Probably don't want that. Don't want that. Oh, let's mod our backpack. Yeah, because the event didn't pop up for me, so I'll have to remember to check them. So we have an event. I don't know what it is, but we'll find out. Uh, backpack. Mod. Grocer's mod. And that, too. Yeah, that, that cuts our weight way down. We were over 100 before, so that actually made a huge difference. Probably I'm just carrying a lot of, like, what... Oh, 40 purified water. Okay, that's why. Um, let's do... Do I have Born Survivor? I do. Okay, what should I take out? Let's take out the Gunslinger perk, since I don't have any pistols. Uh, let's see. Born Survivor. There we go. Perfect. All right, what's the event? Moonshine Jamboree. All right, well, we can get hits and stuff. I'm ready. Only bought Battlefront Collection to play online, but you couldn't find a match, and your game kept crashing. Oh, that's terrible. Minerva needs to have unique items added to her. I agree with that. I would love to see Minerva have items that were not available anywhere else. There's like unique Minerva plans. So I would like to see that. Doesn't mean it'll ever happen. Moonshine with melee enemies. Is that what it is? I didn't even notice. Oh, okay, sure. <laughs> of course. Moonshine with melee enemies. Why not? It is, it is what it is. I'm having trouble maneuvering today. Let's talk to this person. The sooner we get it started, the sooner we get it ended. That's what I like to hear. You can never shine them. When are you getting the next double XP weekend? It is April 11th is when it is when we're getting it. Do we have the events notification? No, no, no. It it just stops working. <laughs> it just it just stops working. It works fine and then it just stops working during I don't know. This is like four or five streams in a row, something like that. It's, uh, yeah, it's been pretty rough. Ooh, level 99. I may get there. I may get to 100 today. Well, I, I gotta say, it is kind of interesting. Every time I start, it's like I have no idea what it's gonna be in terms of weapons. And, uh, yeah, I wish I, I, I kind of, on hindsight, I kind of wish I had a heavy loadout, but, yeah. Not really much I can do. Me? I mean, I don't really need my. I don't know, because I want to do critical. Thing is, I want to do critical hits. So, because I want to do critical hits, that's the. Uh, that's the thing. Get two or three notifications, then it just stops. Yep. Yep. Happens uh, every week, it seems like now. All the 76 you can stand. <laughs> Okay, Kylie. Thanks again. Have a good one and get better. Get that pneumonia gone. How dare you? At least it's not reflective. I mean, I'd rather have melee than that stupid reflective. Well done. Boom. All right. And I'm reloading because I only had 200 rounds left. You know, that's... Uh... Come on. There we go. I only had 200 rounds left, so I had to reload. Eat way too much salad and healthy stuff? Don't, don't eat salad. Why would you do that? Eat ice cream. Eat uh, pizza. Okay, so I saw this thing on... Uh, I saw a commercial yesterday, and I'm kind of wondering if anyone's seen it or tried it, because I'm really curious. Uh, so, KFC, Kentucky Old Kentucky Fried Chicken, they have this thing called a chitza. Which is basically a pizza, but instead of the crust, they use a chicken. So you basically take a piece of fried chicken and then you put the sauce and the cheese and the pepperoni on top of it. It, it seems very gluttonous, and I, I don't know, but at the same time, I'm going, it's really got me curious. So I'm kind of curious if anyone's seen this or if anyone's uh, tried it. <laughs> I don't know. It just, it, it looks, it's one of those things that looks really awful and intriguing at the same time. Right? Ooh, that was my response too. And then I saw it and I'm like, you know, if, if I had one, I'd take a bite. I would try it just, but I don't know that it's something I would actually go buy or ever order. <laughs> You're welcome. Sounds like a pizza version of the Double Down. I don't know what the Double Down is, but it's, uh, yeah, it's, <laughs> I don't know. A thousand calories? Oh no. I, I think you're under, under, underestimating a bit. Probably by half. 
It's got to, it's, oh yeah, I used up five rounds, that's why I reloaded. You know what, let's, uh, actually, I don't know. It's like on the one hand, if I'm holding this weapon, I get ammo for it, but if I'm holding the dragon, I could, I could try the dragon. Problem with the dragon is it'll break so quickly and I don't want to repair it, so I really effectively can't use it. Oh, there's Tom. Hi, Tom. 10,000, it's, pr I would say, yeah. I would say 2,000 at least. I mean, 2,000 is probably still being, that's probably only half. I mean, it's just gotta be just insane in terms of the calories. And it's all fat, too. I mean, uh, fry, I mean, you start off with fried chicken, which is already taking something healthy and making it unhealthy. And then putting cheese and pepperoni on top of it. Yeah, that's not a, it's definitely not something to eat if you're trying to lose weight or live a long time. Hey, Tim, welcome, welcome. Thank you very much, thank you. I'm having fun with it. Definitely suboptimal, although I'm still, I would say I'm still uh, much better off than with RNG. The RNG one was, uh, even when I got good weapons, I couldn't do anything with them, so. At least this one I can spec how I want, although this, in this case, I'm not really spec uh, I, I would say I'm, I'm suboptimal for this particular weapon. KFC is already terrible. Yeah, I agree with that. I I haven't eaten it. I haven't eaten it one in years, but every time I every time I do, I always end up feeling sick afterwards. So it's not and I'm re I'm glad those reloads are faster though. This thing's a good this is a good gun. I bet I would have no trouble giving this away if I decided to do that. I don't know that I will. I do have a low health character, so this could be one I probably want to stick in my stash. For that one day when I go want to go heavy guns with my low health character. <clears throat> Double down was a chicken sandwich that had chicken instead of bread. And oh, oh, oh yeah, I remember seeing those. Those look so gross. So you take a piece of chicken and then you put another piece of chicken on top and then you put a piece, another piece of chicken. Yeah, that looked so disgusting. Yeah. Now that's not one I would try. That's just... Uh, and I'm sure that one has more calories than their pizza, but. KFC is pretty decent. It, it's lean cuts of chicken, etc. Oh, yeah, but then you fry it. Doesn't matter if it's lean, if you deep fry it. <laughs> I mean, it's like, oh, I got this healthy. I mean, lettuce is, you know, let, salad is good for you, but if you put it in batter and deep fried it, it wouldn't be healthy anymore. So. Better quality chicken than you get from the supermarket. Oh, okay. Burger King, Arby's, Long John Silver's, those places are also terrible, especially if you're good at eating at Long John. I've never eaten it. We don't have Long John Silver's here. I like Burger King, but I haven't. Uh, there was one that was close to me, but they they closed, so I haven't eaten at Burger King for a long time. I don't do, I mean, I don't really do a lot of fast food anyway. But. Arby's, yeah, I'm not a huge Arby's. Not a huge Arby's fan, although they have the meats. That's what I hear. They only deep fry the battered nuggets here. The rest is flame. Oh, flame grill. I don't think, uh, I don't think KFC here knows how to do that. <laughs> I, I don't think they, I don't think they flame grill everything. It's, I mean, it's, I mean, the, the F in KFC stands for fried. It doesn't st stand for flame. So, oh no, I got the, uh, green blood, uh, disease. What does this do? What do they give you? Oh, snot ear. Plus, minus two perception. Well, I think I've got uh, uh, four disease cures. We can make do. I can always make some if I had to. I'm okay. Arby's is space meat. There you go. Let's see, where are we at? Defend the stone. Okay, and once again, thank you to everyone who turned in the acid because or the venom. I never remember to do that. So... We got missiles going. All right. You don't see the Hellstorm missile launcher all that often. I mean, you don't see missile launchers that often either. They're not really the best tagging weapons. They're kind of slow with the travel time. By the time that you hit the enemy, they're already dead. So I wouldn't think missile launchers would be the best tagging thing, but maybe, maybe they are. I don't know. We need fresh meat. Come to the Discord. Stop it with the... What? I have no idea. I have no idea what that is. Oh, Arby's is what makes me think of the meat goo from Breath. Oh, jeez, that's Breathridge CD. <laughs> he 
You ate a double? Oh, Tim ate a double down once. I just barely saw that. Yes. Oh. <laughs> it's like regret. I gotcha. I gotcha. Oh, no. He must have had a... Uh, it was either a visual bug or he must have had a scout banner. I keep reloading. I don't need to reload. This is... Uh, this is how I play heavy guns, by the way. I, I shoot, and then I reload. <laughs> and then I shoot, and then I reload. Because that's how I play. Tactical reloads. See, I'm under 200. I'm only I have 196 bullets. I got to reload. Autocorrect is changing your XO to a smiley. Oh, well, that's fine. You know, what's autocorrect for except to, uh, you know, correct you? Where are we at? Wave four? Okay. <laughs> Good. Wave four. Oh, yeah, with Gatling Plasma, Gatling Laser, that's the worst thing you could do. With this, it's not that bad. Um, it just kind of defeats the purpose of having... Uh, use a lot of rounds. I'm not sure I'm getting back what I... Uh, we'll find out when I loot how I'm doing. I think I was at, like, 100... Uh, or, like, 3,100... When the event started. All right, there we go. How much have I used so far? Eh, not too many. I should get a lot. This event is usually pretty good for ammo. Especially if you're just tagging stuff. Which I haven't been doing, but I'll do now. With Gatling lasers, it's not as bad as Gatling plasma because now we've got Fusion Core Charger available. That is true. That is true. You can always put them in the Fusion Core Charger, so... Can the, now, here's my question. I haven't done this. Can the Fusion Core Charger... Um, will it charge Ultrasight Gatling or Ultrasight uh, Fusion Cores? Or will it only charge regular ones? That's a question I have. 30 cores. That, yeah, having to swap in four cores. But it's better than having a bunch of half-filled ones. I love, the, I love the 50 cal. It's my favorite heavy gun. It's one of my top five. If I was going to make a top five heavy... Or top five weapons, 50 cal is in the top five. It's not number one, but it's in the top five. Never use UC. I've, I used, um, actually I never have either. I've never really used the Gatling laser. I use Ultrasight Plasma Cores, but not Ultrasight uh, Fusion Cores, so. No, no, you haven't tried or no, it won't, or no they won't work. <laughs> LMG 50 cal. Yeah. Gatling laser minigun AGL. Think when you have time, you're gonna start a new character. Can only use variations of what you come out of the vault with. So, well, it depends on what I mean. If you're gonna start a brand new one at level two, that's a 10 millimeter and a and a combat knife. That's it. And leather armor. If you're doing a, uh, if you're doing one of the level 20 starts, then then it's gonna be different. It's still gonna be leather armor, but oh, someone's getting insulted. I hear the insult bot. Vault suit, leather armor, that's it. Well, you could do a shielded vault suit like that. I mean, that's actually, I mean, that's what I'm wearing on this character. It's okay. Do you think human flesh has distinct taste or could pass it off as animal meat? I, it's, that's one of those things that I don't spend any time thinking about. Hey, lyrics and fallout human flesh tastes like iguana. Yes. <laughs> you can upgrade, but only those things. Right. I'm assuming, when you said variations, which I assume you mean like max level stuff too. Yeah, I, I think that's a fun idea. I like those weapons. So I ended up a little bit ahead on 50 cal rounds. I think what I'm gonna do is, let's uh, let's open up. I have two mutated party packs. Let's just open them up now. Get me some ammo. Oh, what is guns and bullets? Unscoped, well, this is unscoped. So let's do that. Let's read that. Okay, so that'll give me some more screws and armor. Armor's probably better than anything I'm wearing. There's that, there's that. Okay, let's go. Make sure I don't have any fusion, let's see, notes. Before we go looking for Lou, all right, so we've got 3,900 rounds. Shouldn't use that many inside the mine. So we'll sell angler meat and daddy-o and this. A jillion gulper innards. 
Do that. Super twisted muscle syrup. All right. Well, I already actually have twisted muscles, so I could sell it for easy caps, or I could save it for some other time. There we go. Oh, let's turn in our treasury notes. Then we'll go find Lou. There we go. All right. Lou, 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 Lou. Lou is right. Oh. Let's make it active and then I know. This is what I should, I forgot about the, the beginning part. I should have done all that too. Uh, cheating death, because then you have to go through all that nonsense. All this dumb conversation that serves no purpose. Doesn't affect the quest at all. Iguana Bob is the goat. You only know gold prestige. Uh, AA explosive breaks slower. Gatling is your favorite. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one for sure. Gatlings are good. Um, they're very ammo efficient. They do nice damage. <clears throat> be right back. All right, I'll be here. <clears throat> Don't ask an Englishman. Yes. Don't ask anyone. Let's see. Go to his room. Let's go into first. First. Can I go in here? Too bad. You know what would be really cool is if this was like a door I could go through. Some secret area. It's like a level three lock and yeah, it's not a thing. It's just cosmetic. Like everything in uh, Starfield, all the containers of Starfield. There it is there for set decoration. You can't actually interact with them. Okay, but I'm not bitter about it. See you in New Vegas. You have Gecko, which is similar to, oh yeah, New Vegas, you have a, yeah, that's true. Gecko, it's like Iguana. Uh, let's see, find clues, Fisher's Terminal. I could do that, or I could just speak to him. Cause I think all you need is either high strength or high something. I should be able to pass any kind of check. It's that hacking is because if I hack his terminal, I still have to do the conversation. So let's just talk to Fisher and uh, where is he over here? All right, talk to or Caleb or you no know, Fisher. All right, yes. Found a note. Where is he? Okay. Strength of eight. Yep, that's all we needed. Uh, okay, I don't care. I, that's that's why I don't do this very often because the dialogue is just stuff I don't care about. It's like, I don't care why he's depressed. I just, you know, I was thinking about this today, how they should have done these quest lines instead of having to do them linear, where it's like you have to get Lou, then you have to get Rara, then you have to help Johnny. It should give you all three quests at once and then you can do them in whatever order you want. I mean, that would make a lot more sense than having it because it's not like they have anything to do with each other. I mean, Meg knows who you need right at the beginning, right? So she's to say, these are the people we need. Get these people. And then you should be able to do it in whatever order you want, right? So I think that's how they should have. And same with the other, with the foundation one as well. It should have been, this is the people that we need. So this is how, you know, and then you can pick the order you want to do it. I mean, it doesn't matter a whole lot, but it's still, it's one of those things where it's, it's linear when it doesn't need to be. Okay, so, oh, is this where I'm going? Oh, I'm like, that's the nuke zone. I'll just go here. We'll do that. <clears throat> um, yeah, you guys are still talking about iguana. Okay, <laughs> have fun. Have fun with iguana. But yeah, I was, I was, um, Tim Kaine did a really, a really good video today talking about um, non-linear video games and you know when you're having an rpg linear you know having linear quests is uh, is bad design which i agree with it right like the whole idea is you want to have the player you want the game to react to the player rather than the player reacting to the game and like this game is really bad that way everything is so linear i mean it's kind of the way bethesda does things anyway uh, but this game is especially bad in terms of of how linear it is uh, the quest. You can't do things out of order. You have to do things in the order in which they say you have to do them. And that's what got me to thinking about this particular series of quests. It'd be like, you know what? I should have all of them laid out in front of me and then I could just do them as I wish instead of in the order that it tells me. And I didn't pick up this location. I'm going to step outside again. Hate the player, don't hate the game. Yes, ah, you can hate them both. I'm going to go right back outside because I did not. I don't think I picked up this. Okay. Yeah. Let's go back outside. Because <laughs> Bethesda. Now I'm hoping that distinguished guests or something come up. I was on a server yesterday and I joined the server and um, distinguished guests is, is, is going. 
And people are actually doing it. And there was a lot of people. I'm like, oh, this is a good, this is a good event server. That's what I wanted to do was events. It's a good event server because I mean, if people are doing distinguished guests, that's a sign that the event is a good event. It means they'll do anything, right? So after B, after um, that is done, the next event that comes up is Beast of Burden. I'm like, well, they'll do that for sure. Nope, not one person showed up. They were there for Beast for for um, distinguished guests, but Beast of Burden. No, we don't want to do that. <laughs> uh, so there you go. People say, okay, still a guanamy. Yes, weasel. We like weasel. Uh, let's see. All right, we can find him. Let's see. Ammo boxes. I want to loot those whenever I see them. There's not really not really a lot of loot in here. Let's see. We've got... Uh, oh, look at this. Oh, we got to talk to Lou. Miserable bitch, or son of a bitch, rather. Come on. There we go. I mean, I think we could just let Lou rot, but whatever. Weasel is also uh, almost as adorable as Rose. I like, yeah, I like Weasel. Squirrel meat is actually cat. No, there's cat. There's actually cat meat, and you can actually cook it. If you go to, um, we have that. All right, thank you, Bane. I appreciate that. I'm, I'm just gonna do this. I'm gonna do this until the next event. I don't want to have to start and stop this one over again. If you go to right, where are we? If you go to here, um, Toxic Larry's. There's actually cat meat there. I think it's on the very top, but there's actually cat meat and you can cook it. So that is the thing. It is separate in this game. All right, what do you want? Weasel has a solution and they won't ask you what. Yeah, Weasel's great. I like Weasel. I wish Weasel could be, a, like if this was a, an offline game, I would take Weasel as a companion and let Weasel come with me. I mean, I find most companions irritating, but Weasel I like. I, I I don't have any issues with Weasel at all. Oh, you're trying to wind up Hermos. <laughs> if you kill actual cats in game, you get cat. Yeah, that's true. That is true, Derek. You know, I don't remember if I don't think cat meat gives you any any buffs or anything. Cause I did cook it once, but I didn't eat it. I'm just like, no, I can't. Camp ally. No, I want to take. I want Weasel to come with me. I don't want. I don't care about camp allies are annoying. All they do is jibber jabber when I'm trying to do stuff at my camp. I'm trying to figure out what to do. When I'm at my camp and I'm crafting, I go into my shelter just to shut up everything at my camp. So, cat meat jerky? I yeah, I don't know. Plus three agility? That would make sense, right? I don't think it's it's really. I mean, maybe it's that, but that would actually make sense, right? Because cats land on their feet, you know. So granting you the power, if you eat a cat, you get the power of the cat. I don't know if it does that, or if you're kidding or not, but. Want to bring Ward as a companion so you can get him killed? Well, there's that. Is there two? Yeah, there's another one. Oh, I'm back here. I think there's there may be an ammo box back here. Uh, maybe. Yep, ammo boxes. 50 cal rounds. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Anything in here? Nope. We don't care about plasma grenades. They suck. All right. Let's uh go down here. All right. We're communicating with low level. Oh, okay, Bane. <laughs> it worked anyway. It caught my attention. Cat meat should decrease fall damage. That's right. No fall damage. Does it? Okay, I'm kind of well. Now I'm kind of curious. Now I want to go kill a cat, <laughs> just to just to cook it. See what the benefit is. There's more than one here. I know there's not. I mean, I know there's more than two. Come on. Maybe. Maybe not. Oh, there's a laser rifle. Let's take that. Uh, scrap for mods, because you know, Blake, break bloat fly. That's uh, I think that's radiation resistance. Let's see, food. Oh, acidic gulper venom. We don't need that. Yeah, rad resist. Okay, let's do a new cherry. Top us off. All right. Cat murder. Just get cat meat from Toxic Larry Frit. Yeah, but then I have to go there. It'd be more fun to go, you know, let's go kill Sedwick or not, uh, Cheswick. Cheswick the sexy. I knew there was another one. At least. All right. So let's see. I don't think we can interact with this or we can we? Yep. Dirty water. No, thank you. All right. So we've got, uh, we just push the button. I don't think these turrets really do much.
Um. Ah! <laughs> okay. There we go. Are the turrets uh, hostile to me? No. Okay. Stim packs, fiber optics, waste antiseptic. All right. Let's go in here, get some uh, ammo from there. Ooh, level three safe. That could give me something good. And Uthar, no mini kill a cat. Uh, okay. Can make his character female. I could. I could make the. Uh, I could make the character female. I'm not going to, but. I don't, I don't know that I'll ever do a stream character that's female. I do have female characters, but uh, if it fit, like if I came up with something that was like, okay, this this would only work if it's a female, then maybe. Like that one I was talking about last time, right? Fashion, the fashionista or whatever. I just don't know what the weapon would be for that. That'd be kind of fun though, where, you know, dress, uh, had to come up with like fabulous outfits and whatever. Can meat stew is cat meat. All right, it could be. Do I have can meat stew going? I had it going. I do have it going. Bonus XP, which at this point, I don't know that I care a ton about XP. All right, let's go in here. It's a trap. Don't do it. Don't do it. No, wait, this door doesn't open. Okay, let's go back this way. Wait. Ah, Weasel's with You know, it seems like most of the time when I come in here, Weasel doesn't make it through the door. I think the point of the fashionista is to showcase the weapon, accessorize ladies. But what would the weapon be? That would be the thing. What would what would the? Because uh, it's not like you can use a hairbrush as a weapon or something, which would be really cool if you could. Like, what would be a weapon that would actually fit? It would be like a fashion thing. I don't know what it would be. We. That's funny. The look on your face when it looked like you were going to die. It was funny. Isn't there a? Oh, there we go. Ooh, legendary death skull. Okay, that sounds, uh... Yeah, here's where my lack of damage isn't, uh... Isn't super helpful. I'm blinding myself. There we go. Juggernaut something. Juggernaut's pipe pistol. Last round, yep, my favorite effects. I used way more than 12 rounds there. What do you think of two Fosh Knots in a year? I think it's too many. I mean, the way I would like to see them do all of the seasonal events, so not just Fosh Knot, all the seasonal events is um, once for one week at a time for twice a year. So basically every six months you get it for a week. Two weeks at a time is just too many, even if it's once a year, two weeks is too many. So one week at a time, twice a year is what I would like to see. Uh, fancy shotgun that actually works. I mean, that's fancy. It's it's sort of sort of works but uh, Quad railways. Yes, a rolling pin. You know, that's kind of sexist. Mr. Epos Are you saying that a woman's place is in the kitchen? I think that's what you're saying when you when you say stuff like that <laughs> Besides that doesn't go with fashionista. I mean that's a destroyer. Okay, that's uh, your name is scary, too All right, so far this is going all right this, uh, this... Okay. I got... Uh, okay, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm following the quest marker. I forgot about this part. Okay. No, that's why I can't go any farther. There is a fancy revolver. It's terrible, though. It's a single action. It's one star. That one has variable star. I mean, that one... So, like, the fancy is always the same effects. At the shotgun, the revolver is different. It varies. It can be anything, but it's only one star. World of Fallout is based on the world of the 50s and that culture, that period. Well, yeah. Gold paint for any weapons. I do for the 10 millimeter, I think. The gilded paint. Yeah. I don't have it for this. How about a syringer that shoots makeup like shut? Well, yeah, except I can't customize the, I mean, I can't create a weapon. I have to use a weapon that actually exists in the game. So if there was a syringer that shot, syringer is not a good weapon though. I've tried killing, you can't kill stuff with it. You can make stuff weaker. You can, you know, do other things, but you can't, uh, let's see. I know there's a cricket here. Come on. There you go. Boom. Uh, that's not the, that's not contextual at all. But I don't really know. Like there's not really any weapon in here that I would count that would fit for like, you know, 
what I'm thinking. Maybe a 10 mil pistol because it would be tucked in like the garter or something. So that would be something small like that. So like a suppressed 10 mil pistol. I don't know. Decal gun from, yeah, Power World. I'll just import weapons from other, ga <laughs> other games. That uh, same problem. Let's see here. Can I, nothing loot there. All right, you miserable bastard. Let's just get this over with. The the loop. This is the uh, the conversation loop that's really hard to get out of. You see them fears, right? Yeah, I think that'd be kind of fun. You know, have a character that's always like every week. I would have like a different fancy outfit on, but I don't know what a weapon would fit with that. So maybe a weapon that doesn't fit, like a fifty cal. You know, like maybe something that's completely contrary to what. With the outfit. So the complete opposite of that would be like a 50 cal or something. That'd be kind of fun, actually. So I could do like a fashionista that uses like heavy guns. Ah, that could kind of work. Um, I mean, mom would get mad because all the makeup with the first go would make everyone look like a clown. Yeah. Green like skin for Grog Next Axe. Big red. G oh, there's the there's the rose. The um, oh, what is that? The paint for the the pipe wrench. Um, Yeah. Can't remember what that one's called, but that one, they did it for Valentine's Day. Brightly colored skin, language. He's speaking English. If you had fashionista, you'd probably use cute weapons, a fat man, <laughs> baseball bat, <laughs> love tap, burning love. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, okay, jeez, come on. I understand. Okay, yeah, this, this dialogue, it's a trap. You can't get out of it. Just like, come on, how do we get to the end of this? Um, I get it. Not sure. Okay, God, just <laughs> what progresses us to the next the next dialogue? Just let's. Uh, okay. Uh, this is why I don't like doing lose quest. This part right here. Uh, let's see here. Don't be stupid. There's a better way. This. Um. Let's see here. Okay. We'll deal with it if it comes up. Not duty. It's God. Yes. I give you my word, I'll kill you. Remember. Don't want nah. <sighs> you go I got it. Yes, yes, yes. I'm done with Lou. I don't have to talk to him anymore. Okay, let's uh and I'm definitely not doing the vault raid with them. There's there's no way. No way I'm doing the vault raid with the raiders. I'm I'm just not uh, not patient enough. For, oh, let's see. I just want to jump up here, see if there's any um, any ammo, any ammo boxes. All right, let's go to crater. Talk to Meg and then rah rah. Bouquet of flowers. Yeah, I can't remember what it was called though. Heart wrencher. Thank you, Derek. That's what it was called. Kabloom. Ah, Kabloom sucks though. I'm not you. I'm not gonna do a build on Kabloom. Kabloom is awful. Hey, Elizabeth, welcome, welcome. Convince him to go home. I just want him him out. Misogyny is strong in this chat. <laughs> if you ask Elizabeth, you'll end up with an AGL or minigun. Honestly, I kind of like the idea of a 50 cal. So I wear like a, the fancy, you know, like a fancy sparkly dress and use a 50 cal. Because I like just the, the contrast of the, you know, the, the girly outfit and then the big ass gun. I kind of like that idea. I don't know if I'll ever do it, but uh Wait, hold up. To hell with that. It was a good man. I knew a lot. He's not a, he's a he's a jerk. Okay. okay. Anyway, guess you never There we go. No problem. I will try to uh No problem. I, but ultimately, I don't care. All right. Once Luke I literally don't care. Gail's the ever They can all go to hell. The only reason to do the vault raid other than Slugbuster is to kill Johnny. Okay, so the next one is to do find Gale, right? Fun and game. Speak with Gale. Ugh. Another conversation I'm not hugely fond of. Like most of the conversation in this game, actually. Gale needs help. No time. Do you have? Oh, I don't have the gold. Fi not on. No, not on this account. I may have it on the other one. I don't have it on this one though. How do you get the Easter Bunny mask? That was from a seasonal event, I think, wasn't it? Wasn't that a prize from one of the seasonal things that we had to complete? I think, I could be wrong. Like a special, or a seasonal challenge rather. That's what it seems like it was from. You're on your female character right now and you just wear the t-shirt and slacks for reasons. Well, there you go. 
that's how I would prefer. I mean, you know, that's that's what I like. I mean, I'm not really into dresses and stuff, but it would be a, for a character. Uh, let's see. I think at base, a fashionista as a presenter of sorts. You'd think of it as a presenter. You could sell just about anything. Um, yeah, I guess. I wasn't really thinking about that. I, I mean, fashionista is probably the wrong word, but she would have to Popeye. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Buddy Mass was a holiday achievement was. I think it was. I think it was a... It was a seasonal thing we had to do. And I think the bunny mask was one of the things. Drop in first Adam store, maybe. I don't know. Deathclaw eggs and got the bunny. Okay, that's what it was. Hey, monkey, welcome. All right, uh, let's see. Calm down. Calm down. There's like no good response unless you have high agility. You have to antagonize her, which is just kind of. Um, let's see here. No, that. Unless you have high charisma, all you can do is aggravate her, which is kind of crappy. Like, you should have better responses than this. I get it. All right, fine. Uh, just tell me what to do. Okay, no time to waste. All right, got it. All right, good, got it. Now we can go find Ra Ra. Where are we at with, we've got like four minutes until event, so I guess I'll start it. Yeah, it was Kyleen, monkey. Kyleen did it. I don't think she's still here. I think she had to go lie down because she's got pneumonia or something. Okay, so grafted steel, closest thing is the Pioneer Scout Camp. So that's where we'll go. Mr. Chill. I don't have that character anymore. I don't remember what his deal was. Probably felt like I just wanted to chill, so I created a character just to goof around with one day. I've done that a lot. So many, so many, uh, so many dead dead characters <laughs> like oh this is a fun i'll do this for five i did one a few days ago played around for a few hours and then that's it characters i mean it's still there i don't e oh i thought this was like a big pit right here okay so we want to go where do we want to go the back of grafton steel Death Call eggs are from Atomic Shop. Yes. Well, there was some, yeah, there were like free ones, but there was something else we had to do for the bunny mask. I don't remember the exact challenge, but that was, I think it was a challenge. I could be wrong. Could have been something else. There. Nope, nobody's here. It's, I'm Spider-Man. I'm about to prove that I'm Spider-Man. I'm going to prove it. All right, here we go. Spider-Man, spider, well, nope, nope. There we go. I'm Spider-Man. That's right. It's, yeah. Egg hunt one season. There was something, yeah. Part with Rara glitched out on your first run through. Yeah, my very first time it glitched at me. At the very end, it glitched. But using AA Spike Walkie K with no supporting perks is actually great fun. Yeah. Hey, Alex, welcome. Yeah, I have I actually did... Um, my tourist character used a walking cane. I think that was the tourist. That's what I used as my main weapon. It was great. Hey, Crazy, welcome. Gilded pit. Yeah, there's a gilded skin for the 10 mil. I have that on this account because I've used it on guns for other characters. So let's make sure my company T is going. Company T is... Okay, driving the bus today. Company tea and uh, canned uh, dog food. And we'll do another canned meat stew. All right. Let's do this. If the next event comes up is really compelling, I'll go do it. But other than that, I'm going to wait till the mutated. In fact, I may only just do mutated stuff today. There we go. All right. This is probably going to be a drain on uh, ammo, I would think. Wheels on the bus go round and round and round. Oh, is the, uh, was the stream spinning? I mean, it looks fine now. Was it spinning there for a second? Nice about the 50 cal is it's really easy to, uh, to aim. This is actually the gun that got me to learn how to manually aim in this game. Cause before that, all I did was Vats characters. I mean, I'm still doing vats a little bit, obviously, but. All right, Rara. Let's do this thing. Maybe. If she'll ever talk to me. Come on. All right. Come on. The there we go. Company T is driving the bus. Oh, okay. Yes. Oh. Company T is driving the bus. Good. Why didn't... 
Nuclear winner. Yeah, well, same with me. That's, I mean, it was nuclear winner that got me to try this gun. I mean, it was daily challenges that got me to do, you know, the first scoreboard that got me to try nuclear winner. And it was nuclear winner that got me, got me to try a heavy gun. So if it wasn't for the scoreboard, I never would have had a heavy gunner. I mean, I probably would have, but not when I did. Let's pick this up. Even though it doesn't go to that, because that would be way too easy. Decide to create a second character for storage, and she will be an extremely buff lady gunslinger. Oh, fun. Mr. Chill should only use cryolators, freezing grenades, and cold shoulder. I would have to revive him. I don't know. I have no idea what that character was. It was just a... It was one of those spur of the moment, let's create a character and do something. Maybe I wanted to try something out, or, uh, you know, I don't know. I mean, I've done so many characters that I've just, like, created just to test something out really quick. You know, test out this thing. Oh, what do we have? Moonshine Jamboree. You know what? I have no trouble skipping that. I did it already once. I'm good not doing it twice. Are we going to be able to do Nuclear Winter Gun some someday? I, my guess would be no. I think there's no chance of that at all. I would love I would love it if they brought it back, but I no. I mean, I, the big issue with that is that they just don't have enough resources to support a different game mode. I mean, that one never came out of... It was always in beta. I mean, it never even came out of beta. So that told you basically all you needed to know about that mode. Born Survivor was a good choice, but ooh, I'm taking a lot of... Uh, hang on. <laughs> hang on. Uh, my energy resistance is like nothing, so... Okay. Yeah, my energy resistance is nothing. Find Ra Ra's toy. I will if she opens the door. Imagine if they brought it back for like one week, then took. Oh no, that would be awful. I, I can't imagine. I mean, hopefully they won't do anything like that. But uh, push the button. No. Oh, that was the button she pushed. Uh, wait, how do we open this door? Oh, we just have to talk to her again, and then the door opens. I think. I don't care if she likes me, just, uh, there we go. Now does this door open? I don't remember. Okay. There we go. Sealed wonder, oh, that's good. They can't even support the world. Yeah, the worlds, they don't do anything with the worlds, right? So, would make you quit. It wouldn't, you, you can't help you. Uh, let's see, is there something that maybe I could do, some maybe I should just do drugs here. Uh, let's see here, psycho buff. Extra health. All right. Extra health, extra endurance. Since my energy damage is basically just non-existent. I mean, it's not like my regular, my regular damage or my well, broken toilet. That's, I was hoping I could build a broken toilet. That's so funny. It's like, here's a plan. You can build a toilet that's already broken. Like as soon as you build it, it's broken. At least the reloads are quick though. I like that. Button click you. Oh no, it's the other one that's locked. So blinding. It's like I've got a Vanguard armor piece and I've got, uh, and then I've got a bloody 50 cal. So yeah, they, they work great together. I think this is just a button click, yeah. Uh, ooh, pumpkin pie, that's extra health. I think that's extra health. Um, all right, that's all we got there. I feel like I should put on a hard hat. Guess just look forward to your first beat week in Invaders. Invaders, I really like a lot. I think that's, I think to me, that's the, probably the best seasonal event that they have. I hope it's, something tasty. it's good for circuits. If you like, I ain't giving her company tea. <laughs> Nuts to that. Uh, have some dog food. Yeah, I'm not giving her company tea. I don't care. I don't care if she's if she's uh, dying of thirst. Meat week. Meat meat week is really hard on the servers. Like that's the biggest thing, and none of the other events go. I mean, at least with the invaders. The the cool thing about invaders is it happens at a different location every time. That's what's fun about that. But exactly. Well, I ate dog food. It's good enough for if it's good enough for me. It's good enough. I could just get through that. But I still have to wait for her. So. Whatever, let's see, I probably have, let's just do a bunch of uh, this. Get our health up. Might as well. If you do the prime cuts well enough, you can get two or th sometimes three every 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah. Go carnivore before meat week. 
Yeah, I mean, if you want to, if you want to make the melee foods, especially the yagwai, uh, yagwai foods, that's where you get the meat. I don't kill. I don't carry sugar bombs. All right, so this is the assaultron. So I think my best bet for the assaultron is to just cripple the leg. Cripple the leg. Come on. No, oh, that didn't help. My damage was like nothing. Ah, okay. Where did she? Okay, wait. I can't move. Okay, what the hell? <laughs> it was like I couldn't move either. Okay, she's. Oh, okay. That was a lot rougher than I thought it would be. Damn. <laughs> the beam was freezing me in place. So not only could I was I take a damage, but I couldn't move either. So that was bad news. Born survivor. Good choice. Ikuza, hello, hello. Crap, crack open a can of dog food every time you go to a funeral. Okay. Uh, open security door. There we go. Uh, let's see. Always carnivore. Yes, she staggers you, cripples your head and torso. I guess. That doesn't seem fair. I think that's uh, cheating. It's like boss mode. There's really no reason for me to get that, so we'll just keep on going. Actually, you know what? No, I'll take that. Because if I do do power armor ever, I'll have a helmet. So we'll, we'll do that. Okay, good. Yes, uh, get that. And then I'll store that helmet, and then if I end up doing power armor ever, I'll have a helmet. Because I don't have one. Properly stuffed. Time to go lurk and snooze. All right, have fun lurking and snoozing. My head's crippled. That's right. I mean, I would have been okay, but she stay. Usually, they don't stay. Um, they don't stay chameleon or uh, cloaked. It's like they they go in and out of it, but that one stayed cloaked, so that was a problem. You'll keep in line. Yes, your head is permanently crippled. It's empty apart from the tiny peanut and symbol clapping monkey. Come on. Come on. Push the damn button. She's right there. <laughs> Just like push the damn button. Okay, we're taking this. And uh, is this leveled? No, oh, it's still level 30, which is what I thought. But yeah, we'll. Uh, if we ever do power armor, we have a helmet now. And now we wait some more. Yeah, this is, uh, don't do what I'm doing. This is not optimal at all. Let's see, there's that. I guess I can look at my perks. I mean, I do have heavy, uh, darn it. And I don't have, uh, yeah, I don't have points to spend. So, I mean, what I could do would be move to the Rifleman perks all to rank one. And that would be three points I could do to strength. Then I could have one rank of all the heavy gunner perks. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. After this, because I'll have time, hopefully, before the next mutated event. Yep, there's gun thingies in there. There's usually this guy right here. Probably burning through a bit of ammo. Oh, there we go. That's fun. Uh, let's see. There's a holotape. Grab this because it is your password for this. You don't have to hack this. You can hack it, but you don't have to. Let's do that. And there she goes. Yep. Password right next to the terminal. There were security. On oh, on this, uh, on the 50 cal, uh, it's pretty good, actually. I mean, if I was full health, I mean, low health it would be. It's bloodied, explosive, faster reload. So, yeah, it's, it's a good roll. If it was anti-armor, I would, yeah, I would be really happy, but it's not. Yeah, if I got like unyielding armor or something, that would have been tempting to try and go, uh, try and go low health. You'd use it, yes. Oh, legendary effects, yep, that is, it's a really good roll. I just wish it wasn't bloodied. I wish it was something, uh, something else.
There we go. But in terms of heavy guns, if I have a heavy gun, I'm going to use this is going to be my choice. A Galling gun would have been good as well. Galling does, does, gun does really nice damage. Yeah, good thing I have lots of stim packs. Let's see. Does she want to do I want to go this way, right? Yep, this is where I want to go. Almost to the end. Hey, Gene, welcome, welcome. Final, oh, I love Final Word. My heavy gunner uses Final Word. I've been using it for, what, four years almost? So, I haven't I haven't ever gotten a better 50 cal. So, yeah, I love Final Word. I think it's a great gun. Uh, somewhere, she'll meet me somewhere. All right. I'll be there, wherever somewhere happens to be. Over the rainbow would be my guess. Or in this room. Yeah, the waiting on stuff is the... I mean, obviously this quest can glitch. It's not too bad. It's not as bad as other things in this game. It's the waiting, though. That could be a bit annoying. Yeah, and the other uh, the other gun that I have that I'm not using because there's not really any reason for it is not a camera. It is the dragon. It is suppressors with bash damage and reload speed. Reload speed is good. The other two aren't really useful, and the dragon breaks so quickly that I wouldn't be able to use this much anyway. I mean, I don't have repair kits. I've got like two or three repair kits, so. I think I've only done like one queen event on this character. Let's see here. Um, miscellaneous repair kits. Oh, five. I have five repair kits, more than I thought. It's not as bad as it was most. Well, the, you know, for me, the biggest thing was at the end, the robots wouldn't come out at the end. I think that's I think that happened to me a couple times. I don't think I've ever had other issues with this. I could be wrong. But everyone's strange. So that would mean nobody. But the the delay being able to talk to her. Okay. Yes. Can I talk to her? Now I can talk to her. Yeah. It's just the slowness I don't like. Oh. Take a look. In this one. All right, now follow her. Now we go through here. We have the card cuz she gave me a card. I think. There we go. All right, we got a couple more robots right here. One right here and one over there. Gutsy and a protector on. All right, uh, let's see. Back this way. We got a couple. She'll drop me some uh, useless grenades. I think I tried using these once and they don't really do anything. No, there's a box over here. Is it an ammo box? Is it a... Oh, it's a chem. Yeah, it's a chem thing. I knew there was a, there was a container over here. Yes, pick up the uh, useless pulse grenades. They are useless. Wait for the robots to come out before you... That's the key here. Don't attack them until they're actually all the way out. Because that can cause them to... Uh, to not come out. They get a little shy. There we go. Uh, let's see. Nuclear grenades are your friend. Exactly. Chainsaws horribly bugged. Yes. It is bugged. I would like it if they would fix it, for sure. Couple of weapons like that, named, and a boss, and the best possible role, like Final Word, Fact Finder, Cold Shoulder. Yeah, I mean, the only thing that would make um, Final Word better would be something like faster reload or reduced weight, because that third star is kind of meh. But other than that, holy fire, Batman, yes. Ran around godforsaken hallway. For okay, so I should be able to deal with, uh, come on, there we go. All right, so this thing will come out. And we'll fusion core it, and that'll be that. That's with the fusion core. That's that's it. That's how you take care of sentry mods. I'll wait for two. Ex Actually, can I do 50 cal aluminum scrap? There we go. All right, we got everything. Electron transfer conduit. Hello, hello. Yes, exactly. <laughs> be that way. I'm not coming out. There's rah rah. Okay, we're getting this done, and then the last thing will be Johnny. And uh, yeah, I haven't done Mayor for a day. So going to, in fact, I haven't even, I don't think I've been to any, anything even close to um, uh, Watoga, so. All right, uh, let's see. <laughs> yes, yes, uh, let's see. I don't care, just whatever, there we go. I'm not doing the vault raid with them anyway. So let's see, I don't remember if there's anything in here I want. I don't really think there is. There's workbenches and stuff. 
But just in case there's ammo containers. Oh, there's a chest. Uh, yeah, that's not... Oh, I'll take this. Nuka Quantum. Food in here. Nope. Mac and cheese we don't want. I think that's everything. I guess I've never taken this elevator up. I'm assuming it just takes you right in the middle of Graft and Steel. Not really where I want to go. Oh, Moonshine Jamboree's still going? Okay. <laughs> I guess I'll go and get the, the, the completion for the event. A little bit of something. Get me a little reward at the end. Why not? It's got to be about over, right? We got to be like most of the way through Meg, uh, Meg, <laughs> wave four. I'm cool. Yeah, 30 seconds left. All right, that's the that's the right amount of Moonshine Jamboree. Like 30 seconds left. Oh, Galadorn's here. Oh, I was gonna try and bash him, but I guess we're not, it's not mutated, so. Almost done here. Pick up some caps, 12,600 caps. Level 102, I've already got, I think more level ups this time than I got all of last stream. I didn't get a lot of level ups last stream. It wasn't a very good, uh, I don't know why. I don't remember why. I think it was the events I was getting. They just weren't the best events for XP. All right, uh, let's see. Let's go, let's scrap this. Whatever I've got. Keep our helmet and let's go talk to Meg now. Miss mutate events so much when they go. They certainly do liven things up. I prefer the mutate events to Foshnot. <laughs> I prefer everything to Foshnot though. I just, I'm so over Foshnot. If they, unless they redesign it, which I know it'll never happen. Well, hey. All right, we did this. Give us some more rep. Well, many don't like And then go talk to Johnny, the biggest uh, D bag of them all. But they ain't sucks. All right, uh, let's see. Glad to help. Look a little. All right, so what's next? You want to get by. Johnny, two guns, Weston. Okay, what do we need to do? Think of a mad thing is that being since you know. Yes. All right, you got it. I'll talk to Johnny. Well, the first quest took us forever, but these. Uh, okay. Yeah, these last two have been uh, pretty quick. Where's Johnny? Go see Irene. She'll turn. Where's Johnny? Miss Old Western Shuffle. Oh, right here. All right, here we go, Johnny. Don't hey point that there, gun at me. You rank 209 out of 100? Wow. <laughs> I am not even close to 200 on either on either one. I mean, I don't even, I'm not even at 150 on this. In fact, my main account I might be about 150, but this one. Yeah. So here's I just I just haven't felt like it. I got a plan to free. All right. So. Cuz eventually it's just, you know, what do you get? Food supply. Half the competitors extremely efficient. Well, you have a, you went back to work though, Derek, right? So you not uh, you don't play as much as you did before. Now, so right. Once you get into Adams, yeah, that's true. But I already don't spend the ones I have. So. All right. So you want to? Okay, that's great. We'll go there. Yes. All right. Now we can go clean up our inventory before the next mutated event goes off. Yep, we've got like a minute. That's perfect. Adam's what you get. Yeah, and perk card packs and, and, uh, I mean, it's worth it for that. I mean, if, if you have a character that you're trying to grind perk, perk packs for and, and levels for, it's worth doing. Uh, but if you have characters where they don't really need anything, then it becomes less worth doing. Let's see. We'll get rid of that and that. All right. And, okay, we got to, uh, put that helmet away before I, uh, Turn it into whatever you get when you scrap a helmet. I think you only get like plastic on power armor. You don't really get anything, anything good. It, it's like plastic, I think, when you scrap power armor pieces, seems like. To be fair, you're only working like three, sometimes four days a week. Oh, that's okay. But that's more than zero times, right? So that's a lot. It's something. Pulse grenade, we don't need. Radix, we don't need. Right away, we don't need. We're keeping super stems because we are. Let's see. We don't need that many grenades since 
I don't know if I've used any grenades at all. I probably have at some point, but how much water do we have? Eh, we'll get rid of some of that, although we don't have to at this point. What about aid? Um, we're good there. And what's our condition of our stuff? Ooh, our armor's in pretty rough shape. I'll have to deal with that afterwards. All right, what's the event that came up? Test your metal. Well, I like test your metal. Test your metal. I did not see what the mutation... Oh, group healing. Okay, we could do it. I am glad we got a new season coming. This season seems like it's lasted forever. I think that's kind of how it is, though. The December season always seems like it lasts forever. It takes more than a tough name to survive in there. Which it kind of has, right? I mean, three and a half months, because it started the, the first week of December, and we're going the last week of March, so it's like three and a half months. That is way too long. We should be already into the next season, but it is what it is. Well, there's a person there. There's a person there. There's another person. Well, there's four people here. <clears throat> Beatrice the Wrench. I like Beatrice. I don't know if I could take that voice, though. I think she's fun, but I think eventually I would get a little... I would get... It would get old, I think. I think it would get old. I don't know. I like my hat, though. Okay, do I want to... Jeez. Let's see what it takes to repair. I'm going to go repair this armor while we're waiting for people. Put on armorer. Is it armor? Is it armorer? Let's see here. Does armor make repairing stuff cheaper? No. That's the other one. That's like whatever. Let's see what it costs to repair this. Volatile uranium fever. Ooh, yes. That's, yeah. Okay, so to fix this takes wood. Seven adhesive? Um, you know. What is it? It's, um. I'm trying to think of that, uh, the, what is it? Is it fix it good? I think that's what it's called, fix it good. Uh, let's do that, it'll take, uh, does, I don't know if it takes less, fewer materials though, I guess it doesn't. But if I'm gonna spend workbench repair parts, I'm going to fix it up to 200%. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, there's, I always get it's fix it good and the other one is uh, weapon artisan. I can never remember which is which. So let's see, fix. I mean, obviously weapon artisan would be for weapons, but off the top of my head, I can never remember the names of them. Uh, let's see here. So we'll fix this. Yeah, it still takes a lot. Seven adhesive, a lot. Okay, but that's okay. And the other one was this. Ooh, ballistic fiber, ouch. That's okay, that should carry me through. So let's put on gunsmith again. Heavy guns wear very slowly. Let's do a um, company tea and a uh, perfect bubble gum. Where's perfect bubble gum? There we go. That's why we got it. All right. I think we can talk to him. Let's do it. see you again. The gladiators are. My teammates. I'll be in contact. There we go. All right. Prepare for the arena battle. I am ready. Ready to die because my character is super squishy. I'm glad there's no robots in the, uh, wow. Wow, I'm taking on a lot of rads. Are we in a nuke zone? Oh, no wonder nobody's coming in. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we're in a nuke zone. I didn't realize we're in a nuke zone. Uh, okay. I'm really squishy. I'm glad I repaired all my armor. Fix it good is for percent. White, a white knight. Yes. Hey, Ariel Sato, welcome, welcome. White Knight, that's the one. I should have gotten that. I should have gotten that one as well. That's okay. It's too late now. Okay, so my my resistance is like nothing. So that's a thing. Ah, no. <laughs> I should have gotten power armor. I take it back. This is a. Uh, Next stream, or I mean, uh, I want to go back to the beginning and get and do power armor instead of regular armor. I think I have Nuka Grape. There we go. That'll heal me as well. Afro Man, hello, hello. White Eyes for less damage taken. Yes, but it uh, also it also reduces the repair cost as well. I'm pretty sure it does that, but it's too late now. We're just gonna we're just gonna stay out of range. Someone didn't bring a hazmat suit. 
All right, I'll just go into tag mode, I guess. And uh, that's me. I'm just, I'm just tagging. I'm a tagging fool. There's Galador with his. Uh, what is that one for? The mace? Is that a Grognak one? For some reason I was thinking. Uh oh, he's in. No, he got too close. All right, let's go kill a. Uh, There we go. Oh, John, thanks for playing. Have fun. Enjoy your dinner. Yep, it is under agility. That I knew. Kind of curious. Let's see here. We've got no, the next round. I'll look in between rounds next time. Daily Ops. Why are you doing Daily Ops? It's not Daily Ops time. It's mutated event time. Right? Yeah, this is a mutated event. And after that, let's go to the uh, Raider Arena and hope for the best. Second Assaultron of the day. Good tagging, good tagging weapon. Yeah, back in the days before Legendary Crafting, the gun I have could have been, I could have posted it on, like, Market 76 and gotten just piles and piles of flux for it. Back before the days of Legendary Crafting, when it, everyone was dependent on, like, random rolls from the purveyor or random drops. Rad Shield stacking doesn't... Rad Shield uh, doesn't stack anymore, no. Yeah, all the damage one to four. That's right, lots of damage. That's mostly from the explosive too. Um, let's see, I was gonna look at White Knight. White Knight. White Knight, somewhere. Yeah, it's cheaper to repair. Yeah, so yeah, so that would have been that would have been the perk that I should have taken. That's okay. Two hundred percent is a good thing as well. No, you can't, Mr. Epos. I actually checked uh, the Glowing Fungus Soup, and you cannot stack it anymore. Yeah, you used to be able to stack that to just insane amounts of rad resistance, but yeah, not anymore. Uh, let's see here. Kill that one, and... Alright, everything's dead. I'm gonna get to level 104. That's something. Uh... Jeez. They're so dumb. Stand in the fire. Stand on top of an explosion. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> brother, brother, people are dumb. Let's see. Get some hits on that one. See, I was doing, like, seven damage on that one. If I do fusion cores, I'm getting... I don't know. It's hard to tell. Not much more. No armor penetration. No damage cards. Well, that's what I was going to do. I'm going to check that out after this event. Hug? Someone needed a hug? Oh, okay. Not sure if you... <laughs> All the hugs are free. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go get some... Uh-oh. This guy, uh... He, he didn't, uh... He was so young! T-51, Brotherhood Night Paint. There you go. Alright, uh, let's see. Let's get out of here. Get out of the area that is all glowy and radioactive. Drink? Should give you something. I think. Doesn't seem like it wants to, Derek. I don't know. It should, I think drink is a thing. I'm pretty sure. I know beer is a thing. I thought drink was a thing. Hug is to bring up the bear head because Mr. Bearhead is on your server. Oh, yeah, Bane. <laughs> on my server. All right, let's do that. And... Uh... Wait. Oh, it's this one. This one that I didn't have. Okay. I don't want to uh, wear armor that I'm not supposed to be wearing. That would be wrong. That would be cheating. Uh, let's see, do that. No. Uh. Uh. No. <laughs> I'm glad they put this in between two workbenches because, you know, gotta make it so you get on a uh, Hunter's Mole Miner Gauntlet. No. So you accidentally get on a crafting machine once in a while. 3,900 rounds, that's pretty good. 
So I'm gaining ammo slowly but surely, which I will need for this next time. Right away, let's see, we're still doing the super stims. Uh, let's see, so, in terms of, what do I have? I have an expert heavy gunner. Do I have any others? No, okay. So let's take uh, master and regular heavy gunner. We'll start with that. Uh, heavy gunner. Ooh, what is bullet shield? I mean, bullet shield is one I would uh, 20, well, no, that's dumb. And master, we'll do that. Beer, yeah, beer work. Does T work then? Um, I don't know, probably not. I haven't really added commands in a while. At least none of those. For a while I was putting them in because people were using them and they were asking for different ones and so I was putting them in. Uh, but yeah, people haven't really been using them that much. All right, so let's put in one rank of, actually, you know what? Let's just take out Master Rifleman. Let's just do it that way. Rather than buying a bunch of perks, let's just do it this way. I'll move three points into strength. Uh, let's see. One, two, three. One, two, three. Do that. This will give us a little more damage. And Master Heavy Gunner. What does that put our massive damage at? Not a ton, but... Uh, 81. Okay, so not too bad. Did I get a plan? I think I got a plan in here. I got that plan. And that plan. And buzz play. Loud car driving by. Broken toilet. Um, all right. Let's go to Grafton. Or not Grafton. Watoga. Oh, I have Watoga. All right. Outskirts of Watoga. Here we go. Coffee. I don't think coffee's in there either. He drinks Coke, Monster Energy, and tea. Yeah, he he always talks about sewer water, but all he does is drink garbage. So it's not like it's not like he's drinking all this healthy stuff. He drinks he drink, he drinks garbage too. So cake. I think candy's in there. I don't know if cake's in there, but I'm pretty sure candy's in there. If you want to know what's in there, just it's exclamation commands. I think it's exclamation commands will tell you all the things that are in there. I think that's what it is. Well Exclamation commands. Yep, we're running, running, running. We're not fighting. We're afraid. Yeah, you don't drink any better than coffee. No, probably worse. Coca-Cola. That's what I'm drinking right now, actually. Coke in bottles. Oh, yeah, with the real sugar. It's, yeah, that's good. It, it's so expensive, though. The Mexican Coke. It's it, At least here it is. Maybe in Mexico it's cheaper, but here it's really pricey. Follow me. Remember, yeah, if it's someone's I'm birthday saying. for sure. I don't know what there is. Like exclamation commands, I think is what it is. It'll tell you all the things. It'll list all the commands out. I hate Johnny. Just, I wish this was Johnny right here. I wish this was Johnny. There you go. You can get a case at Home Depot for pretty cheap. Oh, okay. I have never, uh, I've never, I would never even think of that. I go to Home Depot once in a while. There's one five minutes from my house. There you go. That's all the things. Hey. Yeah, I have pizza in there, candy, taco. You better take him inside yeah. and fix that quick. All the stuff. <sighs> no worries, old chap. Oh, yeah, okay. I may actually make the next event from this. Dance. <laughs> pizza. Hey, Jules. Welcome, welcome, welcome. The commands are coming up really slowly right now. There's dance. There's pizza. There you go. What do you have to say for yourself? Oh. Slave. This is what I have to say. I won't let it happen again. All right. Now follow Johnny. Maybe. You were busy. I was busy too. Eight ball. What's the chance you get lucky tonight? That's a good question. Come over here so I can put this collar around Not sure. <laughs> Not sure. Okay, so I was going to sit down, but that's too soon for that. Walk faster. Um, Johnny's a... Okay, that just is gross. Get out of me. <laughs> hey, thanks for playing it cool. What's that on your right shoulder? You Whose right match. shoulder? So you'll My character? The current fighters loses before the match is over. I have a good Not sure. Oh, come on, Ape. I'll do something better. I can't just give the same answer every time. That's lame. What? There are three. I'm two. assuming you my character's right shoulder. Because my right shoulder, I don't have any. It's a wood arm. It's uh, it's wooden armor. Let me down. Got a lot of caps riding on you. 
All right, let's sit down and what do we fight first? Oh, it's ghouls first. I should be able to deal with ghouls. Yeah, that's it's armor. It's my painted wood armor. Am I the greatest? All right, here we go. Is he is Mr. Epos the greatest? No, I painted it blue. <laughs> that's that's why it's blue. I sat and waited to be That's you. Okay, just lag. Nothing like a little bit of lag between friends. Okay, how make sure we've got our uh, company tea going. All right, we're good. We should be good for this first part. Uh, that one was the Free State's paint. Because I figured, you know, the wood armor comes from the Free State, so I figured that makes sense. Because you could find the shrouded plan inside the bunker. Yeah, ghouls are something I shouldn't have to worry too much about between blocker and... Uh, what rads? Ghouls are pretty... Not super dangerous. Of course, if I die... If I die to the ghouls, that'll be pretty embarrassing. Ooh, Tormentor would have been an interesting one. Crippy, cripple with uh, heavy guns. Come on. There we go. Let's do a food. Let's see. Nuke Quantum. That'll get my health back up. Perfect. Easy peasy. Maybe I need a question more. I would say no. <laughs> there you go. That's the answer. I would say no. Thought it was a growth or something. Yeah, it's a, it's a new mutation. It's called uh, fungus. It's the fungus mutation. Okay, I'm waiting. Wait, where's the door? Oh, there we go. The waiting is my favorite part. <laughs> Streamlabs is just a bot. It's just a way to... It's just something you can use while you're streaming that'll do automated, you know, that's where the automated messages come in. I lost him on, that's okay. <laughs> he was a bit of a, he was a bit of a troll anyway. Go back under your bridge. Are we done yet? This is like really laggy today. There we go, that took way too long. I didn't even have anything on him. No wonder he lost. Okay, those ghouls were a little more difficult. I mean, they weren't hard, but... Okay, come on. There, this, uh... This area is not being very responsive at all. At all. Wow. People out there I wish it checkpointed after each way, because if you ever have to, like, reset, you have to start all over again. Which sucks. Rage loading? That's fine. Okay. I can only destroy... We got jewels. That's right. We got jewels. <laughs> we got jewels. There we go. It's fine. Get the chems. Oh, I. What did I say? I was okay. I wasn't paying attention. I'm just button clicking my way through Johnny. Okay, sit and uh, sit and wait to be called. Here we go. And Derek. That's true. And Derek. And I don't even know. I should. I should check that. Although. Mainly the mods are for things like uh, bots, which I can't remember the last time I had a bot, so. Yeah, the mods, the mods have an easy time of it in my streams, so. Which is good. Okay, round two, enter the arena. Okay, this is what? I'm trying to remember what this is. This is floaters, and I got the chem blend, right? I'm gonna take it. 100% damage, 100, yeah, this will actually help me a lot. So we'll do that. Didn't know Derek was, yeah. Let's see here, all right. So 100% more damage. Saves the day. Let's see, we want eyes, right? It's eyes on this. That one's legendary. Ooh. Yeah, you get them all on you at once and they really just eat your health. <laughs> ah! I might have to reload. There we go. Is that all of them or will be, there be another round? No, that was all of them. All right. I'm glad I had those chems. Those chems made a difference for sure. All right. I survived. Sitting on 7.2k bullion. What to do with it? Spend it. Buy stuff. Buy or melt it into jewelry. Wait, that's Skyrim. Never mind. Deny nothing or get everything... Hmm. 
I'm waiting. There we go. That was a very undramatic or a very, yeah. Uh, what was his name? Death Klaus. Or is that Death Claws? Either way. All right, the last round is, uh, I guess we have turrets for the Grafton Monster. Grafton Monster shouldn't be that. I mean, usually it's the, it's the, um, if I'm gonna have trouble, it's gonna be with the floaters. It's usually the hardest one. Try and get every single gold bullion plan, uh, Ram. That's how you, that's, that's a grind. I did that once. It took a while because of the daily limits on how much you can get and how much you can hold. Yeah, that's a whole thing. So what kind of um hack the turrets? There we go. Sit and wait to be called, and then hack the turrets. I don't think the turrets are gonna do much though. That's the blowholes. Hey Bane, thanks for playing. If you're waving, oh, another event. I wonder what it is. I'm definitely not leaving now. What's the event? Uh, tea time. That's fine. Okay. Is there waving goodbye, waving to another player, or I don't even know. All right, so here is this guy, and we just gotta wait. Enter the arena, wait, wait, wait. Hurry up and wait. I'm here. The clock has started. Or has it? No. Nope. Okay, come on. <laughs> come on. <sighs> I mean, am I, no, I can't even get close. Yeah, there's an invisible wall. Yeah, the clock has started. Okay, so blow holes. Oh, those turrets are, are they doing anything? I don't know. It might be doing something. There we go. Yeah, that was easy. Yeah, the floaters are the ones that usually give me problems, if something's gonna give me problems. Uh, have I played as a human? <laughs> I think I'm, what? I'm as, I am a human. Tried lots of the bullion items already on the main character. Yeah, I mean, for the most part, the bullion items, I, a lot of them are underwhelming. I mean, there's a lot of stuff like, there's things like you have the pocketed or the deep pocketed and pocketed, which is weird on secret service. It's like, well, I know deep pocketed. Why would I buy pocketed? Or if I know ultra light, why would I buy light? Oh, no mutations. Yeah, I've done a complete, I've actually done a complete playthrough with no mutations, no mutations and no legendary gear. It did not really alter the experience all that much. Got no sound bug. Oh, I hate that Bane. Oh, that's, that's so frustrating when you get the no, when your sound goes away. Yeah, I did all of the all of the main quests with uh, with no mutations. It was you know you miss the faster re I mean for me it's it's speed demon what I miss. I don't run a lot of mutations anyway. Holy shit, this is taking forever. This server is so slow. With this area, still don't like cores. Of course, they're horrible. Cores are stupid. Legendary cores, if that's what we're talking about, yeah. Don't need to spend hardly any of it. No mutation. And da, 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 da. Still have to do a run without fallout first and only what you can carry. Well, my, yeah, maybe. I mean, I might do that. It's one of those things where it's like, I don't. I might do that. If I, if I do it that way, what I'll do is I'll do. I mean, if I, if I were to do it that way, I would do no fast travel as well. So I would walk everywhere and, uh. Yeah, so I would come up with like kind of like a uh, a no a true like nomad thing. What's gonna happen now? Sargento will offer you a drink. So like no fallout first, no no. I would do no camp because I would have no storage. I would just carry whatever. Try something stupid. Yes. All right. Yes. Can we go? Can we go? Can we go? I wonder where his friend is gonna show up at this time. All right. Because he never shows up in the room anymore. He used to, but not anymore. Now we wait some more. No Fallout First is a challenge, a different play style for sure. Um, I guess. I mean, yeah, I mean, it is. The, the ch it's honestly, so the only thing, uh, no, I'm I'm only doing, uh, the edited playthroughs, I don't, I, I didn't really enjoy doing those. I mean, I like doing them, but they're not like, they're, they're really hard to edit is the thing. So... It's hard to know how much to take out. Like if I do a regular video, it's easy to know what to take out, what not to take out. The playthroughs, it's hard. It's hard to know. 
because I tried doing one that was really highly edited when I did the Nuka Shine one, and it felt a bit choppy to me because I only basically I cut out if I wasn't talking I got rid of it, and so it was it I liked it. But yeah, I, I don't I like doing the stream. It's a lot more fun to do these weird things with with getting real time reactions from people. I think that's more fun. Bolt crafting and selling is a big part of the play. The, yeah, and so what I was gonna say about the um you know, doing a no a no fallout first, basically a no storage type playthrough. The only issue I have with that is it's gonna be a lot of inventory management because I'll have to like sort through, okay, what am I gonna keep? What am I gonna drop? And I don't know what that would be like to watch. Like it might get it might get kind of tedious constantly sorting through everything. You know, I'm only going to carry this much stuff of this or this much of this. And so I don't know. I don't know. It, it seems like a fun idea, but in practice, I don't know really if it would be fun. If, yeah, that makes sense. So I don't know. It may be something I try and abandon. One account with Fallout First and one without. Yeah, and I've done that too. Like this account didn't have Fallout First for a while. Um, like when I did my when I did my my first RNG playthrough, most of that was on public servers because I didn't have Fallout First until kind of the very end of it. Wait, Johnny? so Not the mo and it was challenging at times because because be right you know trying to do edit trying to do recorded stuff on a public server can be a pain at times. Sometimes I mean it's not always, but it can be a pain. You can have like someone join your team and uh, you know wave at you or whatever or fast travel to you. You know, and you're trying to record, so it's, uh... He's got fists, the other guy's got an assault rifle. Sure, that's, that makes sense. So yeah, with a YouTube channel, you almost, you almost have to have it, at least on the, uh... You know, on, when you're recording. For streaming, obviously, it's, you know, public server's nice, because people can join you, but... Uh, talk to Johnny? No. We gotta, okay. Okay, where is the dude? Okay, this server is annoying. It's broken. Dude, where is he? Where did he go? I mean, there's Johnny, but I can't talk to him. I have to wait for the other guy. Where's his fr Oh, jeez. All right. <laughs> um, okay, dude, where did he where did he go? Um uh, Oh. Now he'll come, maybe? I don't know. Um, I have no... <laughs> I have no... Uh, sacrifice... Uh, what is this? Interesting. All right. Where's the... Uh... I know I'm going in circles, but at this point, I'm just trying to find... Uh, Hal, is that his name? Where'd he go? Is this, if this thing broke right here, this is going to piss me off. That's, a, that's all I got to say about that. If this thing is broken at this point after uh, after I went through all that nonsense, because I'll have to, because if I leave and come back, I'll have to do everything all over again. The arena, all of it. Okay, there's a raider. I mean, maybe I have to go through and kill all the raiders. Not really something I want to do, but uh, I heard footsteps, though. So maybe the footsteps were the guy. Holy shit, where did he go? Like, he just disappeared. <laughs> you have a bad cold, you're not here. Okay, um, um, what the f- Arg. I wonder if I leave and come back. Like, don't leave the server, but if I just walk outside and come back in. Work baiting. All right, monkey. Thanks for uh, thanks for hanging. I've never seen this before, where he just disappeared. No, I no. See, when you go to Johnny, he he, you can't talk to Johnny. The next thing that happens is Johnny talks to him and then kills him. And until that happens, you can't. Uh, there's no conversation with Johnny. So yeah. Um. I mean, at this point, I made a circuit. I've kind of killed everything. I don't think there's much left alive. Like, where the hell did he go? I mean, it's not like he's stuck. He just vanished. And there's no... Uh... Okay, here's our room. Okay, this is where we start. There's the bookshelf. Uh, what's in here? Anything? 
All right, so there's the room where we start. We uh, go out here, and he's not there. And then you make your way down here, fight, fight, fight. Turn here, turn there, fight, fight, fight. Did I see a safe? Well, there's a safe in there. Uh, it's only level two, we don't care. Uh, down here, down here. And then you come around and go to Johnny and... What the hell? Like... At this point, I think I have to go out. No, the quest marker's on Johnny. <laughs> I mean, that's what it is. You're supposed to meet Johnny and the other guy follows you. He's not there either. I think I may have to leave and come back at, and come back in. And maybe that will... Uh, if I leave and come back in... That's a closet. Ooh, duct tape. Well, that's a good... Two rolls of duct tape. Uh, okay, where is the door to... Is this it? No, nope. where's the door? Maybe I have to leave and come back in. If I do this, it may reset it, though. I checked everywhere as far as I know. I've never had this particular thing happen. I've had them where they wouldn't talk, but I'm going to leave and come back. Hopefully it doesn't reset it. I've had a bug out on me once, but not like this. Okay, so I went out here. Interesting, these raider, the, the raiders out here are hostile. There's Hal. Okay, there's Hal. I got Hal. He teleported to me. So Hal should follow me back, right? Hal? <laughs> he was. He was right there. Um... <sighs> it may have just been broken. I may have to just finish this, uh... Arg. All right, let's, um, just more of a reason to always kill Johnny. Yes. I mean, I don't have to, I mean, honestly, okay, here's, here will be my solution. If I can't get this to work, I'm just not going to finish it because I'm not doing the raid with them anyway. So, so there's Hal. So he's here. He's broken. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go out and come back in, but if this doesn't work, it's fine. I mean, I'm not doing the raid with them anyway, and I've done everything. I mean, all that's left is a conversation. So there's this guy. There we go. Let's go out here. And uh, and then we'll go back in and see what happens. Maybe Hal will be outside. Yeah, more of a reason to always kill Johnny. Yeah, but then you have to go to the... I wish you could kill them before. The guy who made this is now making the Fallout First TV show. <laughs> yes, exactly. It'll just work. What'll happen is you'll uh, turn on the show and it'll start playing the credits. Like that, that's just what'll happen. Let's go right to the credits. You'll be like, wait a minute. Or it'll start with previously on, you know, it'll be like the first episode. It'll want to recap what happened before or yeah. Who knows? Okay, so let's try this one more time. This is my last attempt. If this doesn't fix it, then it's fine. This is just the state we're going to leave it in. Because this is completely unnecessary anyway. Suits you. Aha! That's exactly where you're going. There we go. I heard him. Vague memory of him. There you go. So that's how you fix it. You just walk out and come back in, and that'll do it. And he has no loot. All right, Johnny. Thanks. Fine. You suck. Thanks. Uh, let's see. Sure. Sorry for misleading. Uh, let's see. I don't care. Let's go. All business. Before we... I want you to... Uh, nope. Meg, no. Tell her. Nope, you're greedy. Except lower or tell right, her yourself. Right. You drive a hard <laughs> bargain. Show will crash Amazon. It wouldn't surprise me if the show, I imagine, will probably be one of their most watched shows ever. My plan is to binge it. I'm planning to watch it, you know, start watching it when it comes out and just keep watching it until it's done. It's only going to take six or eight hours, right? All right. Ram left. I'm guessing he's getting ready for date night. I'm guessing. Even though the eight ball wasn't sure if he was going to get lucky tonight. All right, let's do, let's talk to her. Had enough rep to get the backpack grocery. I did. I got it earlier, Brian. I got it after something. When I turned in the, uh, the last quest or the, uh, when I, when I went to the, um, to Robco. We got everything we need. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> I don't need to go. Okay, I thought I needed to talk to her one more time. No, I'm not. No, I don't. That would suck. 
I'm going to go talk to Crater right now. I don't want to risk or to foundation. We're not going to do the vault raid today, but we're going to, I'm setting it in so I'm not doing it with the, with the Raiders. No, no, no. Mint crash in the Bethesda way. Oh, could get to the middle of the program and you have to restart it due to a feature. Well, I could, yeah, all kinds of things. Foundation Let's do this. Raiders. Yes. Don't get along. They want to take everything we've worked yes. It's time. We'll gather I mean, it's not time, but you guys can go wait for me. All right, let's go uh, sort some stuff. Let's do that. Gonna lurk. Thanks for playing. Well, Lucy standing, not moving in her undies for eight hours. Well, I don't know. <laughs> there could be worse things. Oh no, I failed siding with Crater. There could be worse things than underwear. Let's see here. We've got uh, that. Zealot's bow. Ooh. 1300 gold, which, whatever. All kinds of stuff. Okay, let's, uh, all this loot. I've been doing my job. I've been picking stuff up. If the server's laggy, it is not from me. Okay, so I did all of that. Yeah, I'm gonna do the vault raid. Let's see here. Probably do the vault raid, because the vault raid, or my plan for is the vault raid to be the finale. Which is obviously not today, and it will not be on... Let's see, what's today? So my plan for this character is to actually go until... Because uh, I'm going to start a new character with the new season. So on the 29th, so, fr so Friday, so two weeks from today will be a new character. And then I, my plan is to do two more streams of this character, so Monday and Friday. And today's not done, by the way. I'm not ending things. but So Monday and Friday will be two more streams. And so next Friday will be the Vault Raid. And then Monday, I'm going to do another one-off stream. I had an idea I wanted to do. And we'll be doing that as kind of a palate cleanser before the new season starts. And then I'll do a new, a new character for the new season. Okay. <clears throat> so in terms of quests, we've got things we could do. I don't want to do, let's see. Responders, re uh, let's see. Welcome to the neighborhood. No, 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 no. Uh, oh, lying low. Yes, that's what I want to do. <clears throat> lying low. I like lying low, that's why I do it. Because I did Bureau of Tourism last time, right? I did Bureau of Tourism and I did uh, the photography class. Oh, is this person doing a, oh, defend. I don't care about that. Okay, let's do, geez, I could do the mayor for a day. I think I'll do mayor for a day on Monday. So let's let's work on lying low today. Naked spaghetti limbed brotherhood paladin. Yes, exactly. If a character doesn't at least clip through a wall once, then can we really call it a fallout show? Yeah, there's that. <clears throat> Good thing with new red boxes in the game, at least there is somewhere to put all the stuff you can't put in your stash due to not having the room on your non-fallout first account. Hey, Joe, welcome, welcome. Happy Friday to you. All right, so lying low, that is up here. Van low taxidermy. I don't know why I went here. I could have just gone to the train station. <laughs> That's fine. I got time. I figure I'll get into van low and then another event will come up. And maybe we'll do it, maybe we won't. If it's Moonshine Jamboree, no. I'm not doing that again. Unless it's the Mutate event. I'm guessing the Mutate event will probably be eviction notice or something. I don't even remember reading the posters to start this to start this quest, but... <clears throat> I like this quest. All right, so I guess I don't need to have this out all the time. Wanted, cheap squatch. That's her. We'll push the butt package. I don't know if we have to pick that up or not. Let's see. Duct tape. Third person indoor is difficult. It's challenging. <clears throat> all right, so there's another one down here. And we need our gun because there is a rad rat right here. Come on. There we go. Put the bone here. Give me the security code. There we go. Never has been. When he suddenly showed up in town after years of being away, I I knew there was something strange going on. Pardon me, I had several frogs in my throat. All his belongings still here. I'm expecting the show. I mean, I'm guessing that based on what we've seen so far, I think the quality of the show is gonna be good in terms of production, you know, production quality. It looks like it's top notch. Whether the story will be good, whether, you know, anything else, who knows, but. 
The production quality should be should be top notch. I'm sure you know. So I'm looking forward to it. How dare you? Kind of overkill the weapon for a rad roach, but uh, that's okay. Um, let's see. We've got go through here. Download the thing. Yeah, I imagine the game will probably be dead. Mr. Three, he's he's gonna be lurking, but he naps, so he may he could he could lurk lurk and then fall asleep. So. No, that's not what I want. I want this. I think that's something I need to Meet Bo Peep. Download coordinates. There we go. Perfect. All right. Anti-armor, mole miner, gauntlet, uh, one star. Okay. What's our food looking like? Uh, we need company tea. Time for more company tea. Company tea, spoiled meat. Okay, all that's gone. Um, can't dog food. All right, we're, uh, let's, uh, oh. Piles of purified water. Okay, so the next leg of the quest is, oh, a mutate event is up, or an event is up. What is it? Guide to meditation. Meh. Meh. Guide to meditation. No, I'm good. Bastion Park. I don't think I have, this is my closest thing. We'll just go there. He's inhaling funny stuff. Could be. If you say his name three times, he appears. That's possible. If he's awake, he appears. If he's not awake, he doesn't, so... That would be my guess, is he's not awake. Okay, so I got stuff. What's my level? 104. Okay, I should get to level 105 today. Uh, not that it matters a whole lot. 50 cal. I like 50 cals. They're fun. I'm glad that's what I got today. I, I wish it was a different effect. I wish it would have been anti-armor, but I'm okay with it. Bloodied. Yeah, so this will either be something I move over to my low health character or a giveaway. One of the two. I am sure I would have no trouble getting someone to take it off my hands if I went that route. But it is awfully good. I don't usually go for explosive though, so yeah. I'm kind of leaning in the giveaway direction. <clears throat> You've never tried the 50 gun? Oh, Ariel, that's, uh, it's my favorite heavy gun. So if you played heavy guns, I like, uh, I highly recommend it. The nice thing about the 50 cal, it's pretty ammo efficient. It's one of those things you shouldn't have to craft ammo for too often. And, uh, it's easy to aim. Like, in terms of manual aim, it's one of the easiest guns, I think, in the game to manually aim. Oh, I'm like, who's he shooting at? There we go. So, I, yeah, I really like them. It's not necessarily the highest damage, but they're not weak either. So it's not like they're low damage. But uh, considering how big a 50 caliber bullet is, seems like it probably should do more damage than it actually does. Okay. Since the camera is not an accurate representation of what we're actually... Uh, is this cam... I don't think the broken camera was it. This is it. All right. Saul's Grinders, which I know I picked up at one point. Just because, yeah, I had the chance to pick it up, so I did. Make sure nobody's doing anything. Yep, nobody's doing anything. I'm just always checking. Could be something good. Defend Mount Blair. That is a commitment. Defending Mount Blair. That is a whole thing. Favorite heavy weapon is the Gatling Plasma. See, everyone has something different. You'll have one for your PA character. Yeah. Well, uh, you know, honestly, what I would recommend would be to do Beckett's quest. His, um, the... The, the follower, the ally quest line, because at the end of it, you get you get one. It's called Final Word. It's anti-armor, faster fire rate, third star of, you know, wasted third star. It's like damage was resist, was resist while reloading or something like that. Not really useful, especially if you're paying power armor, which I generally recommend power armor if you're going to use heavy guns. Just because stabilize gives you armor penetration, so it's totally worth it. All right, so we're going in here and we're just shooting things. This works pretty well for weak stuff because we can do vats and short bursts. What is this guy doing? Come on. So there's one right here. Oh, come on. It sounds like it's behind me, but it's really up top. Unless he came down the stairs, which I guess is possible. Are you in here? Oh, 
There we go. Not terribly VAT sufficient, but it'll still work for short bursts. Um, ah, screw it. We'll just take it off. All right, let's get uh, our last clue. Long quest for one gun. Yeah, but I mean, if you think about it, I did. I mean, the thing about that quest is at the end of it, it's a nice, you know, it's a nice dungeon. I like. Um, but I mean, I've been using that on my heavy gunner since I got it. So it was a long quest, but it's a gun I've been using the whole time. So thanks for playing, Steve. Everyone's leaving. Uh, let's see. Unlock that. I don't know why. I'm just unlocking it for no reason. Had a stupid goal to have every in-game weapon with bloodied first star. You have 119 different play weapons. Wow. <laughs> that's a lot of, uh, yeah, that's a lot of weapons to have. Favorite regular energy weapon is the laser gun. I like the lazy, uh, the lazy gun, the laser gun. I think it's really good. It's very, um, um, it's very stable, right? It's a, it's a gun that you can, uh, it's good for manual aiming. It's kind of rough for, um, there we go. It's kind of rough for VATs just because the AP cost is so high, but it's, it's a good, uh, good one for that. Low down. Okay. This is patrol car. All right. I'm going to go back here really quick since I just looted a ton of stuff. Server not responding message. Oh, okay. That's frustrating. This server has been kind of wonky. I mean, at least it was for me on that last, uh, you know, Watoga. <clears throat> M42, welcome, welcome. Hope for higher cap stash box, even though you have Fallout first. It's been a long, I'm kind of surprised we haven't gotten any kind of increase at all. It's been a really long time. I mean, honestly, with new people coming to the game, it would be an ideal time to do it, you know, before a bunch of new people come to the game. But because I think that TV show is going to bring people. I think the game is going to really perk up when that TV show comes out, unless it's terrible. Then who knows? But yes, I scrapped pearly peepers. I did that on purpose. Like, I, I don't think there's any use. I mean, what is the use for binoculars in this game? None that I'm aware of. Uh, let's see here. Uh, where's our weight? Oh, 96. All right, that's good. All right, let's go back here, find the patrol car. Isn't there one in the Jeep near the Grafton monster at the top that can be rolled instead of... Yeah, you can roll it, but that quest, what I'm saying is that quest gives you one that's already a good combination of effects, but that was also in the game before legendary crafting was a thing. So yeah, now there's less incentive to do that because you can just keep rolling your own. So, and you can buy the plan. So, I mean, you can buy the plan from Brotherhood vendors and that will, and then you can craft them and roll them yourself. So there's that. I don't know if the one up, I didn't notice the one in Toxic Valley when I grabbed it, if it was my level or not. Cause sometimes when you get stuff like that, it's under leveled. There is the patrol car right here. There's a ghoul right there. And I reload because, you know. I got that. Let's uh, let's see. I don't really want to listen to these for the millionth time. Um, is it back this way? Uh, no. I think I'm too far. Oh, okay. There we go. I got it. I got it. I got it. So we'll grab. Uh, right. This this game is not like third person at all. There's that. Okay. Listen, I don't want to listen to clients. Oh, it's optional. All right. So ID for further instructions. All right, let's go through here. I have to look at the clock every once in a while because when the next event comes up, I won't get a notification. So I'm not sure why I was on the arm, but I was. Uh, final word is the weapon. You have so many useless quest rewards in your stash. Oh, yeah, there's that. Well, I mean, there's a reason why I had to do, you know, try and get the old guard again and the uh, the other one, Perfect Storm, because I always just toss that stuff because I don't ever find a use for them. And I don't like to save stuff. If I know I'm never going to use it, I don't like to save it. I just get rid of it. There's just too much stuff in this game and we can't save everything. So, I mean, you can try. But since I don't have mule characters, I don't really have a character that's built to store things. All my characters are built to play. So, there we go. Further instructions, there is the ID. Man low taxidermy. Bird bones me means I can jump from really high distances. Or high heights. Can manage the AP cost with com combination of company, T, action boy, and grim reaper sprint. Yeah, 
Pearly Peepers puts a targeting blip over enemies. Oh, for um, um, Distant Thunder? Okay. Is that useful, though? I mean, that's the thing. Like, even if it does a thing, is it really useful in this game? That's always the that's always the question about. Um, let's see. We want uh, low heat, and we want uh, delicates, and push the calendar. There we go. <coughs> and let's see. There's a rad roach. Rad roach. There we go. I might have done this once or twice. There's a note here, and there's a scrap of paper here. There we go. And then do the thing. How do you play without a mule? <laughs> I just, I'm not a collector. I'm just not. I'm not a hoarder of stuff. If I'm not going to use it. I tend to get rid of it, which I've regretted. I'm not going to lie. There have been times when um, I've kind of wished... Uh, so I did that. Okay, so listen to behavioral programming. Do I have to listen to the whole thing? I don't. All right, so let's, uh, I didn't mean to turn my lamp on. And uh, status reports. Emergency check in. Download coordinates. Oh, and then this is, uh, so this is the final part when I go and actually get the fixer. Not a fixer plan, not a legendary fixer, just a fixer. Isn't the quest, yeah, this is the quest where they move the cop car. Because I don't think you used to have to go on the roof for stuff, but. Distant Thunder and Rachel don't need to care about Rachel. Oh, and I've never, I've never done a Rachel, whatever Rachel wants you to do, I've never done it because I've never had a recon scope. Uh, I don't carry them around. So whenever I've encountered Rachel, it's just a non-event. It's a non, it's, you know, it's not a thing. So let's see. We need to go right here. Oh, I can go here. All right. We can do this. We can get this done quick, I think. Mm. Except I have to go across the street to Garahad Mining and get a and then get a key card first. Which Okay, so here's a question. Do I have to actually go in? Well, I guess I could just go inside the door. Because I don't think you have to go inside the door, right? I think I could just go across the street. Oh, this isn't it. I think I could just go across the street to Garahad Mining and grab the key card. Or is it a case of the key card doesn't exist? And until hell, <laughs> until I actually uh, read the note, because some stuff in this game is like that, where it doesn't actually exist until it actually tells you to get it. If you don't scrap them, yeah, I just don't carry stuff. I mean, I don't carry stuff around just on the off chance that I have this random encounter. So. I mean, I guess if that was my goal, that I could get the, you know, do a recon scope and wander around looking for, uh, hoping Rachel pops up. I mean, I know you could do it. You could put a recon scope on something that has like 90% reduced weight and, uh, and, uh, and then you don't have to worry about weight, but I'm just, I don't know. I'm a kind of a minimal minimalist when it comes to carrying stuff around. There we go. Now we got to go across the street. Like I said, if I don't think I'm going to use it, I don't keep it. I don't carry it. I think you can get the key card before the quest you found. Oh, okay. This is actually easier to aim in first person than third person. There we go. I leveled up again. Level 105. Awesome. Not sure if I'll ever get, uh, let's, okay. I thought I killed him already. Boom. Let's get this key card. We'll run in. Everything will blow up. Nope. All right. I guess it won't. Now, this is the one where the inside the room that has the turrets, right? It's like, I don't think I'd want to work at an office where the turrets were up above me, pointed at me. That would make me kind of uncomfortable. And the pay would just have to be insane. Like, if you want me to work in an office where you're going to point guns at me the whole time, uh, then yeah, I need to... Uh, you better provide really good... I don't know. Really good benefits. Ammo, though. Ammo's been okay so far. I mean, that was kind of a thing I was a little concerned with, with a heavy... Heavy automatic weapon. 
Because I haven't really been using automatic weapons for the... Are they respawn? Oh, no. Like, are they respawning? Or have I just not killed them all? Apparently, I've just not killed them all. But we're doing okay. All right, let's go in here. There's a robo-brain, right? Oh, we got... Okay. Ah. Yeah, getting crippled from a gun. That's... Uh... No turrets in here? I guess there's no turrets in here. How are we doing in time? I don't know if I can make it all the way to the end. Okay, let's go back to Garahan. We'll see if I can get through this before the next event. I don't know if I can. It's only one and a half weeks before the... Yeah, we're at uh, 11 days. 11 days until the next update. It'll be nice. We'll have new areas to explore. Not a ton, but we'll be able to free roam Atlantic City, so that'd be kind of neat. Kind of curious how that works, though, because if Atlantic City is instanced for everybody that goes to it, and initially, you, know, you got to figure everyone's going to be there, right, looking around. Like, that's a lot of instances of air of, of one location. I kind of wonder how that's going to be for the uh, for the servers, if they'll be able to handle it. I'm assuming it's instance. I mean, it'd be kind of cool if it wasn't. Kind of neat if we could all go there and, and hang out in Atlantic City without being on the team. Have it be like this populated area. I want to go to the top floor. Do we like the new type of seasons or... Oh, it's fine. I don't care. I mean, actually, I think it's an improvement, to be honest. Ba based on what we know, I think it's an improvement. Because we'll be able to uh, pick stuff out of order. So you can uh, get your rank ups and then spend on what you want in it looks like any order but it maybe not it could be like you know certain groups of things at a time but i don't know it looks like an improvement though based on what we've seen other than that i'm reserving judgment i'm not going to i'm not going to whine because it's just because it's different nothing behind me all right <laughs> i wasn't sure if i had someone behind me or not okay come on Check in, do the do, do the do. Okay, now we get uh, this, maybe. There you go, fixer, I got a fixer. There's that, perfect. Let's go in here, take a little bath. That didn't take any time at all, that was quick. Can you still grind the scoreboard like you normally could with the new one? Yeah, I mean, you can. It's just a different, it just looks different. Um, it's just like a different thing. So instead of like when you progress, it automatically unlocks a level, you'll progress and get tickets. And then you can, you can use the tickets to pick up. I mean, you have to unlock a rank by leveling up, you know, by progressing and you get tickets for ranking up and that will unlock sections of the, of the not board, but season pass or whatever. And then you can use the tickets to buy what you want what, for, with whatever you've unlocked. So if you grind it, you can unlock, I mean, Honestly, if you grind the entire scoreboard every time anyway, it's not going to be any different. You're still going to get everything, so... I, I don't know. It's... it's uh, It'll be fine. Uh, what did I... 40, oh, from the fixer. Can I sell this? Okay, as is my... Oh, look at that ammo. Oh, lots of things. Okay. As is my tradition, we will put the fixer. Someone wants a level 50 fixer to play around with. There is one right there. Uh, let's put this, uh, what do we have? Gauntlet. I think I just picked up a pile of ammo, so let's do that. Oh, 4,300 rounds. I am doing, uh, there's that. That. All right, let's go notes. Oh, I got a few things. Prime Gatling receiver, I don't care. Truck bed trailer with junk, don't need that. We'll just drop it on the ground. Probably grind it the same way. You know, I, I don't, yeah, it'll be fine. It's gonna be the same kind of thing. I think for I think honestly, it's gonna benefit people that aren't able to grind the whole thing, or the people that are only grinding because they want that one thing. Then you can just get enough enough to buy that one thing and then be done. So, I don't know. It seems like it's gonna be a an improvement, but we'll see. Uh, let's see. Right away, I don't need diluted stims. I don't need radix. I don't need. All right, time for eviction notice. Maybe got like twenty seconds. You get Fallout first, close to next month's reset. 
Well, and you and you can spend atoms. So if you get enough atoms, you're going to spend atoms and claim all the rewards anyway. So you don't necessarily have to do it with uh, Fallout first. You could do it with atoms and just buy the pass. Supposedly we'll end up getting less useless stuff. Maybe. I don't know. I It wouldn't surprise me if we got the same amount of useless stuff. Because all they've shown, I think they've cherry picked what they've shown us to make it seem like we're getting less useless stuff. But I doubt that's the case. I think they've just shown us selective, selective screenshots of things. I mean, they haven't given us a reward list yet, which they usually do, right? We usually get that. We usually get that a few days before the season, right? Like usually like the week before maybe. So maybe next week we'll get a reward list if they're still doing that. That would be kind of nice to actually see what's on the scoreboard. See, just like I said, eviction notice. Let's see, lie in the sand, melee. Ugh, yuck. Usually get fall first for the scrap and ammo boxes. and Oh, okay. It is very handy. I will say that much. It's definitely not immersive though. And then you go play Fallout 4. If you're used to playing with Survival Tent, then you go play Fallout 4, and it's like, uh... Uh, yeah, where's my Survival Tent? <laughs> where's... I need my Survival Tent. I want to be able to scrap stuff. Uh, let's see here. Got that. Uh, let's see. I'm not fixing anything. Uh, pre-combat check? I don't know. Are people... Oh, people are here. All right, let's do this. There be people. We'll get this, uh, initiate the combat check. There we go. Brace, I am sufficiently braced. So what's my, do I have a perk card? Yes, let's open this up. Probably won't have enough. Eh, I don't know. I mean, I still think I have, how many legendary slots? I have two slots left. Oh, I did take agility just so I get up to 15 because it was sitting at 14 and that bugged me. So I have legendary agility. So, yeah, so I could take two more slots. So that's another two perk points that I could do. And, uh, yeah. Scorch Beast. Gotta love the resilient flying enemy. Are we, uh, there we go. I guess I don't need to do the head. Is that it? I'll let the melee people do it. Oh, that one. The one I'm aiming at. Shoot that one. Okay. I said I was going to do it for the uh, melee person, but melee person's got a melee. Find you. Oh, I love those reloads, even though I don't have uh, lock and load. I still reload nice and quick. Imagine if I had lock and load. This is, this thing would be, the, the reloads would be lightning quick. Yeah, the more I think about it, this will probably end up being a giveaway. I just have to figure out how to do it. I mean, typically I do my Discord. Yeah, so if anybody sees something that, uh, whether it be a script video or whether it be a uh, on a stream, whatever, I don't sell things because I've had people offer to buy things before. I don't sell things. If it's something I want to give away, I will post it in my Discord. So if you want to, uh, and it's not like I constantly give away stuff, but when I do, that's that's how I do it. It's just easier that way. So if anyone is ever interested in something like that, join my Discord. Cripple the Scorch Beast Wiggle. I don't have any crippling perks. I don't, I don't have, yeah, I don't have the crippling perks. And now that it's uh, resilient, it won't, yeah. It'll just, and these turrets are annoying. It'll just fly over forever, like that. Yeah, I should have swapped in Tormentor. Not Tormentor, the other one, uh, One Gun Army. I should have taken out like Class Freak, probably. Cause I only have that in there for melee. So I could have taken out Class Freak and put in One Gun Army. And then I could cripple stuff, but. I don't think you can cripple it now. I think once it's that resilient, it, like you can't, you can't do any more damage to things. So, and if it won't land, I mean that's the thing about these. They should be programmed to land, because to have resilient on an enemy that's not programmed to ever land, unless you cripple it, is terrible.
Because even if you know how to cripple, there's gonna be someone who doesn't. And once the once the health goes to zero, a cripple doesn't work. Yeah, I mean it's terrible. I mean it's 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 a bad. I think that's bad design, personally. Bad bad mutation or bad event design. If if you have something or or make the cripple, make it so I can cripple it once it's you know. I mean, if you could still cripple it this way. Oh, those reloads are so nice. I love the speed at which he throws away the old, you know, whatever, full of bullets. What am I, what am I sitting at in terms of? So I've, I only have nine perks. I don't necessarily want to waste them on, on one gun army. So we're just going to have to live with this for now. Usually when Mr. Epos is here, he'll fly up on his jetpack when he's melee and hit him and punch him. Oh, he's going to land. He's going to land. Get him. Hit him. Yeah, there we go. Oh, there's a challenge. Kill 10 Scorched. Really? It took me until just now to kill 10 Scorched? I didn't even know. <laughs> Seems like I would have killed 10 Scorched before now. Although it's not like we've done Scorched Earth or anything, so. Not a lot of nukes. All the people who drop nukes aren't playing. They're all bored. They're waiting for next season. Okay, I keep I keep forgetting that we should turn that off. There we go. I think all events should be resilient. <laughs> I don't actually mind resilient. I just don't like the uh, having the scorch beast resilient. Unless, I mean, or they could make it so that when she gets to the resilient part, she automatically lands. But to have something that can only be killed by melee, fly around and never land is terrible. Like that's just that's crappy. People are doing mutated events this week. Yeah, that's true. They missed them. I mean, when Fosh when Foshnot was going, we didn't have mutated events for what a month. So, I mean, it's a good way to get script and XP, and it's a good way to get script. Plus, I think it's one of those self fulfilling things where I think I think people do mutated events. Or they do them because, well, I know people will be playing events, so that's why I'm going to do the mutated events, because people will be there. So so people play because people play, kind of thing. Because it can get discouraging, especially towards the end of the season. The, the game kind of dies a bit. And so you can, if you want to do events, sometimes you're just out of luck because people just don't do events. Because people aren't playing. They're done with the season, and they're not playing. People going to be people. That's true. But what are the options? There'll be people. Ooh. Another uh, near miss with my uh, my soda. Come on. No, I'm out of AP. I think, uh, yeah, Company D is still going. Yeah, on the one hand, having a... Uh, Having power armor would have been kind of fun, but on the other hand, then that would kind of rule out vats. I would just burn through fusion cores too quickly. Oh, don't shoot him in the head. I should shoot him in the wing. Him or her. Or they or them. I don't know. I don't know if Scorch Beasts uh, care about that sort of thing. Oh, we won. Look at that. All right. Let's do some looting and then... Uh, let's see. Wing. Yeah, I don't do enough damage to the wing to... Okay. I don't do enough damage to the wing. <laughs> That's the challenge. Wing, 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 wing. Uh, yeah, see, now you can't do wing damage, so... Oh, well. Oh, I'm not over-encumbered. All right, never mind. More interesting things for people to do besides chore boards like nuclear... Win like nuclear winter, yes. Nuclear winter, I missed that. Let's get nuclear winter. Uh, where'd it land? I hear it. Oh, now I'm over encumbered. Oh, it landed and or did it land? I picked up one too many things. Should have fast traveled away while I had the chance. There we go. I don't know if you walk slower with the 50 cal or the heavy gun drawn, but you it looks slower. But I'm not sure if it is. Uh, let's see. We'll get it here. We're, there we go. Yeah, these are so convenient. Especially this event when you can get so much, uh, so many weapons. Learn a lot of mods and get a lot of steel. 
Because steel's hard to get. It's super rare. Machete. I keep trying to get one of those. I was looking through my all my uh, melee weapons today. In kind of all my stashes, trying to find if, see if I had a good machete. I don't have any. Like I didn't. I didn't find any uh, legendary machete at all. Okay. I don't think this is ever going to. And you can't cripple the wing. Yeah. Is it ever going to land? I like how people are still shooting it because. Because <laughs> that's going to change things. Did it die? No, it just got quiet. Oh, I know what I could do. Well, no. Yeah, I can do the... Uh, oh, I can do this. This is a good time to do it, too. Because if it bugs out my sound. Yeah. That's what I'll do. We'll do the uh, imposter event. If this thing ever lands, though. Turrets? Is that a uh, missile launcher? Someone use a jetpack. Take a jetpack up there and punch her. They're trying. I saw Galadorn up there rocketing up. I mean, come on, a resilient enemy that won't land. That's that's so stupid. Like, to me, resilient, when it gets down to that, everything should be crippled and it should be forced to land. Unless I'm wrong. Everyone can disagree with me. It's just a one star. I know. <laughs> I think it's funny just to see if they'll actually get it. Get it to land ever. I, it doesn't look like... Uh, See, now if I had fast travel, this would have canceled it. Let's go, uh, let's go here first. No, let's go here. I don't like this place. Too talky. We'll see if I can fast travel away. Oh, I got XP. They got it. Good job. Oh, wait. It's like a one star. I want the legendary item. Where is it? Right here. Good job, everybody. Perfect. All right. See, that's why I waited. Get the, get the treasure. Get the loot. And then we'll go do uh, the pylon ambush site. Since I know it's not on cooldown, we've been on the server for three hours. And that event hasn't happened. There was Bane. Thanks for playing, Bane. It's probably midnight or whatever where he is. All right. Ooh, I got a radium rifle mod. If I ever get a radium rifle, I can uh, mod it. Come on. Do that. What do we get? What do we get? We got, uh, that's it. Well, that was hardly worth it. A one star armor piece. And I have a couple of fusion cores. Yeah, if I ever get to a point where I need uh, fusion cores, I'm set. I've got a lot. Thanks for playing, Bane. I appreciate it. We need something like Dragon Ren from Skyrim. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Dragon Ren would be perfect. <laughs> shouts. That's what we need shouts. I mean, they have them in Starfield, so they should give us shouts of this game, too. Why not? Warzone, do you get pissed? All right, have fun getting pissed. Have fun getting pissed in Warzone. Let's see, we've got a glowing ghoul. He's dead, he's dead. Everyone's dead. Wow. I'm not terribly ammo efficient, let's put it that way. Uh, Make sure there's no other... Nope, I'm in caution. All right, there's another one around here somewhere. Where is it? Is it inside? Oh, right here. How about now? Hidden. All right, there we go. Yeah, I forgot that I was wearing chameleon gear, but I haven't been sneaking at all, so... Moves a lot quicker. All right, here we go. If you want to get pissed, play Overwatch 2. <laughs> oh, there you go. What's better, Warzone or Nuclear Winter? I'm guessing Nuclear Winter was, is probably better. But I don't know. How I miss you, Nuclear Winter. Yeah. With Warzone, do you have people that you play with? Or is it just randoms? I mean, I'm assuming you can play with friends if you want, but... And Warzone's free, right? Isn't that a free one that you can play? Good luck. Hope you fare better than <clears> I did. 
I wait till I see more people that can actually kill the robot because I am not one of those people. But I can take pylons because I've got uh, Born Survivor. Uh, let's oh, I have mutated party packs to open as well. Uh, food. Let's do. Oh, we got water. We'll just we'll just top off our our uh, stuff that way. And another perfect bubble gum. Another perfect bubble gum. Why not? I'll need to buy some more before Monday. All right, I think we got people here. All right, let's get this thing started. We got people. Looks like quite a few people are here. All right. Uh, initiate recall. Boom. Let's do this. If you wait too long, then you end up with a, an event popping up, and this thing's still going. And the next event might be uh, claw, or, um, eviction notice. Who knows? You have people you play with, all casual, so you get destroyed. It's free. Oh, okay. Casual's the best way. I think if you take those things too seriously, it is. It's a recipe just to get pissed off all the time. It should be fun, but yeah, I get it. I get people that play it competitively, but uh, those kind of things, but I don't know. It's like, we'll play casual and we'll still try to win. Well, there's some, let's use some explodey. Good tagging weapon. Boom. And I reloaded because I was down to 198 shots only. So <laughs> that's good. Yeah, I am not tanky. Especially energy damage. Ooh, look at all those. Wait, I know. Since I never use grenades, let's use a grenade. There's that. All right. Oh, I'm going to go get a... Oh, people are taking them? No, let me take one. Or did someone take them all? I wanted to take a pylon. It's my uh, thing. Oh, I'll help you. Or I'll try. There we go. And that's the character's name, which I never talked about. The character's name is Bud Jet. Get it? Because it's budget. So that's that's the character's name. You can see it up there in the upper right hand, right hand side. Took pylon number two. Good job, everybody. Oh, Galadorn, I got you. I'll save you. Oh, I'll save. I'll save you, and then this thing's gonna explode and kill this guy. Watch it. I knew that was going to happen. It, expl <laughs> it exploded and killed him. Because when you get revived, you only get revived with, like, no health. Oh, somebody's uh, dropped a loot bag. I'm going to steal their fuse. A lot of good junk. Yeah, another reason you stabilized is your, your hip fire is so much better. Because it, it does improve hip fire. Ah! Where was my, um, all that junk I just picked up? <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> probably. Probably get picked up by somebody. <laughs> uh, that's, I do like the animation. I do like the animation, yeah. All right, let's see if I can, uh, see if my loot bag survives. Uh, let's see. Oh, there it is. Holy cow. Oh, I didn't have that much in it, but I got my loot bag back. Perfect. All right, let's leave. <laughs> let's leave. I do like the animation for the reload. I do think it's fun. Yeah, they did a good job with it. Uh, all right, let's go. I don't. I don't like. I don't like. Uh, it's too noisy. At the uh, nuke world, robots are loud. Oh, pages are up for review. Oh, cool. So all the rewards are there. That's awesome. If you ever create a second account, this is my second account. <laughs> you mean a third account? This is my second account, Derek. I mean, it's pretty much the only account people see, but it is my, uh, well, that's not really true. On streams, it is anyway. Uh, Sheep Squatch, nah, I don't care. I've got so many of those kinds of things. No reason to save it. Anything here? Uh, let's see, M79, uh, I've actually got a, well, I did a video on it, so I guess you know, I did a, uh, pages are up for review, hang on, uh, is it posted, where is it, po hang on, is it posted in the, uh, I don't see it, is it posted in the, uh, where, where do they post it, is what I'm wondering, 
See if I can find it really quick. Because if I can find it, we can look at that. Hang on. Uh, it would be here, maybe? Okay, I'm seeing... Oh, there we go. Right here? Do it with the devil. Rank up. Redeem tickets. Oh, pages 1 through 13. All right. Let's see if I could do this. Um... Uh, let's go full screen. Where is it? Ah, where'd it go? Oh, there we go. All right, hang on. Let's try something here. See if this works. Boom! Right? I'm gonna do that. This is this is what we're doing for, for probably the rest of the time. Hopefully that's okay with people. So here is page one of... Oh, this is a terrible... Hang on. I picked a bad spot to be. Let's go. Let's go somewhere quiet. Let's go to my camp. <laughs> I don't want to do it here and listen to a gutsy barking in the background. <laughs> and, but we'll look at it. Uh, like I could do a video on it, but now nah, let's just look at it now. It'd be fun. Oh, Jules. <laughs> Jules. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. Okay. Thank you. Was that you, Jules? Did you sneak onto the server? <laughs> you did. Okay, let's, uh, well, after the nuke. After the nuke, we'll do this. We'll do that. Thanks, Jules. Uh, let's see, where are we at? Um, I lost my... Oh, that's that. Hang on, now my windows are all messed up. You were here the whole time. Ah, sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, let's see. Let's since we all check our food. Our food's good. All right, let's go. Uh, what is this doing? Oh, feed the people. Yeah. All right, we'll do this, and then we will. Uh, then I'll look at the pages. We'll look at the rewards. That'll be perfect. Huh. <laughs> Good thing I fast traveled to my camp really quick. He's not resilient, so I'll shoot him. Oh, my damage is all over the place. You have some decent rolls on the laser rifles, but you just don't get as much out of them as handmaids and fixers. They're different. I mean, honestly, if I was going to play a non-stealth character where I wasn't, uh, you know, if I wasn't going to sneak... Actually, if I was going to do a non-stealth, non-vats character, I would probably pick a laser rifle as my weapon. Um, they do really nice damage, and they're really easy to aim. I mean, handmade is too. They're pretty close. If you ever play Fallout 3 again and decide to use an energy weapon, I highly recommend you get the metal blaster. I actually started a Fallout 3 playthrough not that long ago. I didn't get very far, though. I just felt like, ah, do I really want to... Uh, because I was, I was going to do a uh, melee one, and uh, melee was kind of kind of rough, not going to lie. Early on. I'm sure it gets easier later, but early on it was kind of rough. I went into the, uh, uh, the, you know, I was doing What's-Her-Name's quest in the beginning, Moro's quest, and I went in where the raiders are, the uh, Super Duper Mart. And uh, I was getting picked off like crazy. I could not get close enough to, to kill them. This is really tight. That's too much. I might get some awesome plan. Boom, I got nothing. This was like this was like when I did that video. I, I didn't get anything on any of the uh on, on any of the uh the safes. Which, you know, I thought I'd get at least one thing, but not seeing all the pages, you'll keep looking. Yeah, I'll look. I'll I'll look at them after this because I'm kind of curious too. I mean, I know the main things. I, I well, I know there's the new uh, weapon. Let's see here. The cremator or whatever. I think that's what it's called. I hope it's kind of. I think it's. I think it is early. I mean, like the um. What was it? The uh, short circuit or the circuit breaker? That was level 35, which was kind of high. I mean, I like when they did the cold shoulder, because that was, I think, a level 15 gun. Which is kind of nice. Good tagging weapon. 
Ooh, and I actually ran out of ammo. How about... How about that? Staggers. Staggers are... Oh, I thought she was dead already. Actually, I'm doing decent damage with those headshots. 23 damage. That's actually pretty good. Considering I have no armor penetration at all. Yeah, I'm, I'm burning through ammo at this, but it doesn't actually matter. I don't need to save it for anything. I mean, I guess it's possible I could get another 50 cal, but... For the most part, probably don't need to worry about it. And I'm pretty... And I probably have a ton of materials to craft if I need to. Cremator is just the heavy incinerator from Fallout 3. Well, but it's in... Uh, it's in Fallout 76, so... I'm okay with that. If it's fun. It's not... You know, honestly, if it's fun to use... I'm okay with it. I mean, that's really what I care about. If it's fun to use and I can kill stuff, that's that's what I care about. All right, so we've got this. And there we go. All right, let's go. There's a death claw. Don't forget the death claw. <laughs> Don't ignore the death claw. All right, I'm gonna get out of here while I can, maybe. I may be too slow. We'll see. It died instantly. All right, cool. <laughs> it died instantly. So what I'm gonna do, actually, to make it quieter, well, I'll go to my camp, I'll close out the game, and then I'll, and then I'll, I'll go to full screen for that other thing. Since I'm not gonna do any more events, I don't think. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, make it quieter. And then we'll go over to this. Make that full screen where we were and where are we? There we go. Can I make this a little bigger? Uh, it's hard. Uh, and my head's in the way. Okay, so here we go. Not say it's a bad thing for what you heard it acts like. Yeah. All right, so we've got, this is the first page. It's kind of interesting. They're not numbered or anything. Trying to turn off my controller. There we go. They're not numbered or anything. Ooh, legendary course times 10. So for people that are looking for cores, that's, I think that's actually a good thing. It'd be better if they got rid of cores. We got the Rip Daring outfit, which I like outfits. So we got that. Mystery bobble, oh, three mystery bobbleheads. Who cares? So I saw somebody ask this question, the Big Feet rug. Speculation was that, because they, they do hint at things. So maybe the speculation is that maybe a Bigfoot will be coming at some point, you know, because they do like to hint really far in advance on things. So maybe this is an indication that we're just going to get more cryptids. So maybe that. Silent energy weapon, alien weapons. Yeah, the alien weapons are silent. Yeah, if you want to sneak with energy weapons, I think that's your only, is that your only options? Well, you can use the Crusader pistol. I mean, it's not classified as energy, so it doesn't benefit from the science perks, but it does shoot, you can mod it as energy and have suppress, so you can use that as well. Uh, we got a paint for the double barrel, which we've got a few of those. Ooh, five perk card packs, so this costs you five tickets. Ooh, look at this, a score boost. Obviously, if you're Fallout first, but it's zero tickets, so you can unlock this right away, which I like. Uh, Percival's Pith Helmet. Okay, new cool helmet, liquid courage. I mean, honestly, I think these are all good things. I don't know about the bobbleheads, but everything else I think is a good thing. So I like page one. Uh, next up, we've got the next page. Let's see, everything's... Oh, I'm over here looking, but it's, 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 it's delayed. So we've got... Okay, so we've got another a paint for T45, a hot dog sign, 200 atoms, beach... Oh, I kind of like that, Vents. That's kind of fun. Although we don't have beaches, so we need a place to build. We don't really have any place to build that would be like a beach, but uh, whatever. 500 gold bullion. That's a lot of gold bullion. 500? They don't usually seem like they give that much. A poster, a photo mode, a ship wheel. Okay. <laughs> uh, nuclear key cards. See, there's, a, there's an old favorite right there. And surfboard wall decorations. It's kind of cool. If Bigfoot makes an appearance in this game, you hope it's a friendly creature. Yeah, have it be something that's really shy and runs away. Probably won't be. They'll make it like a boss or something. Uh, next page, we've got uh, 
Ooh, I like tro I like tropical shirt. Oh, tropical cryptid shirt. They showed this in the video, I think. Tiki torches. So you could basically, it looks like if you want to make a beach theme camp, you can really do it. That's what they're leaning into here. We've got the surfboards, tiki torches, this, glass float lights, more atoms. So 200 atoms, uh, another icon, uh, three score boosters. That's cool. Uh, tiki statues. I think people who do camps will like those, I'm guessing. 10 legendary modules. Ooh, I like 10 legendary. That's a good one. And a music box, another camp item. 10 legendary modules. Wow, that's a big, oh, it's a fallout first thing. Yeah, some of this is Fallout first. It's, yeah, it's all lumped together. Before on the old boards, it was really obvious when it was something. So it's kind of lumped together. Hey, Lee, welcome, welcome. First time catching a stream. Well, you are just in time. We were going through the uh, new season rewards. They just popped up when we were streaming. So I thought I'd kind of go out that way. Bigfoot skin for the stranger who comes to shoot your kill. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it could be. Maybe for the Atlantic City build area. I don't think there's going to be an Atlantic City build area, Galadorn. But maybe for the new the new one. I mean, I don't think we're going to be able to build in Atlantic City. I think it's going to be free roam, but I don't think we'll be able to build there. I could be wrong. Maybe we will be, but I don't think so. They haven't said anything about it. Going to wear that shirt when exploring Atlantic City, you'll be on vacation. Yeah, and you have a camera, all that. Uh, peepers. Oh, so so the peepers is going to be for other things too. So we got a lever action paint. Wow, 300. Oh, okay, that's Fallout first. I guess I should specify so legendary script 300 called fallout first. So they're really trying to encourage people to buy that season pass to get this. Cause their rewards are nice. 300 script. That's a decent. Remember when that was the daily limit? <laughs> 300 script, uh, ultra site scrap crate. I have no idea why, why ultra site scrap that doesn't, what do we use that for? I don't know. <laughs> uh, five years in Appalachia can be exhausting. Yes, it can be Duel with the devil poster. Uh, Jersey devil player. I, that's, I like the icon 10 stamps, which people want for like probably mods for the new armor. If they use that a flag, more atoms, that's fallout first again and devilish excavator paint. I like the paint. It's very, it's not like really out there. It's kind of mild, which I like. And we got the cremator. So this is a second page. I don't see numbers though. Like I don't see rank numbers or anything like that. So I'm assuming when you actually get in the game, it'll tell you what rank you need to be to unlock the pages. Cause this is the fourth page in. So this could be a bit, right? I don't know. We'll see. Started getting back into fallout recently, but looking forward to the next big update. Yeah. The update looks like it'll be good. Ooh, this is, a, I like this paint on the Gauss rifle. That looks pretty good. Caps fallout first only 500 whole caps. Adelaide player icon, a bullseye trampoline. Ooh, I bet. I wonder if we can interact with this. This would be cool if we could actually jump on it and show our player jumping on it, but it is Fallout First. Five re rollers, 10% uh, score boost, but that is Fallout First again. So this would probably be the equivalent of like rank 50, because that's that's when it came in before was rank 50, I think. So toy robot set. So for the people that want to have that at their camp, and I'm guessing you could put that on the chessboard. So you put the chessboard down, you could, so you could set up a robot chess set is what I'm seeing from this. So I think camp builders are like that, I think a lot. And we get a new light ally, Adelaide. I don't know what she does, what she likes, what she sells, but there we go. And ball buddies. I'm assuming that's a camp display item, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, let's see. I don't know what the ultra site, yeah, I don't know what the ultra site crate is about. Like, I don't understand. Out of all the junk you could give us, why ultra site? Like, I don't, I don't get it. Okay. Hanging tree. Oh, I like that. Hanging tree baskets with plants in them. That's actually kind of cool. I'm not a camp person. I'll never use them, but I, I like the idea of them. So there's that. Wilson, exactly. A construction loader. So that's, I'm sure, a camp thing you can have. The problem with stuff like that is it tends to be really big and there's not really flat areas in the game. There's not a lot of them. So it's hard to place stuff like that. Uh, devilish paint for the union. I like that. Peepers auto axe. That's a first thing though. Raider cages. Sure. Carry weight booster, 200 atoms, of uh, warning sign. Please keep, keep hands out of the cage. Okay, that's a first thing. Uh, three score boosters, another first thing. And construction barriers. Ooh, I like th I like those for a camp, but that's a first thing as well. They seems like there's a lot more first things. Maybe not. Maybe it's just, yeah, I don't know. Maybe not. It's possible to jump on the Nuka-Cola trampoline. Oh, nice. 2,500 tickets to open all the pages. That I don't know. Um, I haven't, I haven't really paid attention and I haven't looked, so I don't, I don't know the answer to that. It's going to be, but if it's 25 per, I mean, if each pay, if each one is 2,500, 
Well, but it's not. I mean, some are 25, some are 40. But if you yeah, have, it's 2,500 and it's maybe it's possible because I think you do get 25 stamps per rank. Uh, that's a creepy backpack, but uh, cryptid skull backpack, devilish paint for the Hellcat. I like this paint job. It's kind of growing on me. More legendary script and it's not Fallout first. So this is 300 for anybody. Jersey devil's shoe flare. Okay. Peeper's paint for the cremator. 200 atoms, another first thing, repair kits for anybody. Scrap kits for Fallout First and Daring Binoculars. Ooh, so the pearly peepers we were talking about, looks is that a skin or? I don't know. We can get binoculars with flames on them, so that's cool. And a Fallout First thing is a Jersey Devil's horseshoe rug. Probably carpet that you would from a casino. I don't know. Do you know how much the season pass will? It's 1,500 atoms if you want to buy it that way. I mean, you can buy Fallout First the same way that you always did. But yeah, you can buy a season pass for 1,500 atoms. And I'm guessing there's probably enough atoms on the board to pay for it. So there's that. <clears throat> Let's see here. Ooh, I like this paint with the big. Ooh, that's a cool cremator paint. I like that. And that is not a first. That's an everybody thing. 200 atoms is an everybody thing. Oh, okay. So the cremator mods are on the scoreboard, I guess. Slow burner mod. Interesting. So that's, uh, okay, that's later on the board. Five scout banners, and then we got stamps that are Fallout First. Ten legendary modules, that's everybody. A water boiler, this is a Fallout First thing, but you can get boiled. It'll just create boiled water, and you don't have to boil it yourself. So I think that's actually a cool thing, finally. Uh, basically, yeah. I mean, the nice thing about it is, I mean, I don't think it's any cheaper than First, and you don't get the benefit of First. But there are people that have atoms that don't know what to spend it on and they don't want to spend money on the game. So I think it's nice that they get, I mean, it's basically, it's an option. I mean, you get it with, you can either do Fallout first, which has always been the option, but now they give you another option to get it. So I actually think that's a good thing. So more legendary script for Fallout first. There's 300 more script, five lunch boxes, ultra sight paint. Uh, all right, that's that. Next page, a lot of pages. There we go. I wasn't working. Ooh, cryptid trunk. I'm assuming this will be a stash box, maybe? I'm guessing this will be a stash box. That's kind of a cool stash box. I like it. There, there's some cool items on this board so far. I like it. Devilish T65 paint. Uh, player icon, that's a Fallout First thing. Heavy mod for the Cremator. Ooh, that's way up there. So you'll be able to unlock the Cremator early, but it looks like it's going to be a while before you can get the, all the mods. Peeper's paint for the pump action shotgun. 10 legendary cores. So there's a few cores on here. Cryptid wallpaper, vault tech supply crate times three. More gold bullion for Fallout First people and another poster. Yeah, there we go. Just use the atoms from Fallout. Yeah, I'm assuming. I'm assuming as, as much. Well, if you have Fallout First, then, then that gives you the pass anyway, right? So, but if you wait until the end of the season, then yeah. Brahmin Corpse, I don't think I would want that at my camp. <laughs> 200 atoms, that is Fallout First. Good luck emote. Oh, I like a good luck emote. I like that one. Devilish X01 paint. Don't really see a lot of X01. Scrap kit times five. Caps, 5,000 caps? Damn. I don't think I've seen him put that many caps for one, one reward before, so that's pretty good. Uh, mystery magazine package. Oh, so three magazines. Cool. Wet floor sign, Fallout First. Oh, so they make a, a floor sign that we can place in our camp. That's cool. I'm assuming that's a camp item and not just something we can scrap. Uh, score boost, Fallout First, and an autopsy, autopsy table chemistry workstation. Ah, cool. Just to open pages. Um, what? What do you mean just to open pages? Wonder if we can stack those Brahmin corpses to make walls? Oh, <laughs> I don't know. Will the Brahmin corpse give me or spoil me or just decoration? That's a good question. It doesn't, unfortunately, there's no, we can't, whoops, we can't click on it. It won't, we we can't get more information. This is, this is all we got. Um, I would assume, actually, I don't know, because it could be spoiled meat. It could be decoration and it could be, I, I would guess it's a decoration, but I don't know. Need to claim 95. Well, I don't know if you need to claim all the rewards to do that. I, I think you just have to earn the ranks. And as soon as you earn the rank, it opens the page. So if I want to save all my tickets and open and, and wait till I'm at the end, I can just buy all the stuff at the last thing. I think that's it's it's kind of unknown at this point, but I think that's I mean, that's how it sounds like it works. 
it's certainly how they've implied that that's how it works, but I don't, I don't know for sure. Next up, we've got a grass roof kit. Oh, so you can have roof on, or roof on, grass on your roof. That's kind of cool, actually. I like some of the stuff in here. You can actually do some theme camps with some of this stuff. It's pretty neat. Uh, another mod, a napalmer mod for the uh, cremator. Uh, duh, a photo mode thing, carryweight booster, repair kits. That's Fallout First. Pine Baron's wallpaper, a Peeper's plasma caster paint, 300 legendary script. Wow, a lot of legendary script on this board. And this is not Fallout First either. So more atoms for Fallout First and a Jersey Devil's shooting gallery. I'm assuming this will give you some sort of boost, but I don't know what it is. And it's Fallout First as well. Look at the last two pages. Oh, it says it. Oh, okay. What you saw before, I think we have to use them to unlock the last. So we have to unlock, we have to basically spend everything for one page before we can unlock the last one. Interesting. Or just before we go to the last page. Homemade xylophone. Oh, okay. I bet this is a thing we can use as well. That's a fallout first thing, but you can probably play it. I'm guessing. Jersey Devil Stein. Uh, barrel mods for the cremator. So it looks like all the cremator mods come from the scoreboard or the season pass or whatever we're calling this. Uh, Icon, devilish T60 paint, uh, 500 bullion, five re-rollers, which is fallout first, scouts banner times five and lunch boxes that are fallout first and more atoms that are for everybody. Unlock everything as you go anyway, don't, I'm kind of the same way. I mean, if you unlock the entire scoreboard, it doesn't matter. So, but it kind of takes away, if you can't unlock all the pages and pick and choose from any page, then it kind of takes away from doing this, right? Like what's the point of having it this way? If I, if I have to unlock, if I have to spend all my st stamps anyway, I don't know. Let's see player icon perk coins. Okay. That's usually towards the end as well. 50 perk coins, devilish T 51 paint, uh, repair kits, more legend, another 300 script for everybody. Devil's wings, jet jetpack. Ooh, I wonder what this is a jetpack for. Yeah, this is a fallout first thing. I wonder what this is a jetpack for. I wonder if this is for the new armor or for anything. I wonder if this just works for anything with a jetpack. That's kind of cool though. I mean, it's silly, but it's kind of fun. Uh, 5,000 caps, 200 atoms, which is fallout first and a wall art and a cryptid hunter paint. Ooh, that is scary. Well, that's pretty scary looking power armor. 75 stamps, new armor. Okay. Uh, let's see. We are still going here. Challenge, complete challenges to rank up and earn tickets, redeem tickets to claim rewards. Oh, okay. So I think that's all that means. Yeah, I'm not reading that as, yeah, it says it here. I don't think that means, so you complete the challenge to rank up and earn tickets, right? So you complete challenges, you rank up and earn tickets. And then if you want to claim the rewards, you redeem the tickets. I don't think that means you have to go all the way to the, yeah. I don't think that means you have to spend them before you, yeah, I don't think you have to spend early ones to get the later ones. I don't think that's, that's not how I understand that. That's not how I'm reading it. New scoreboard system doesn't sound bad so far. No, I don't think so. People are complaining because it's different and people will find something to complain about. Uh, we've got the stairs for the Pine Barrens log cabin. Oh, and a cabin kit. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's, oh, I like that. Can make a log cabin camp. Oh, I like this a lot. That's kind of cool. Uh, Peeper's paint for the combat rifle. I'm assuming that'll work for the fixer as well, but you never know. Uh, gorilla statue. Surf. Oh, you can make uh, surfboard shelves. Uh, chemical color mods. For the cremator, I'm assuming that I'll just change the color of the of the projectile, I'm guessing. Sports balls. Uh, Cyclops power armor helmet. Ooh, that's kind of... I think that'll be a popular one. Uh, wall decoration surfboards. Wait, wasn't that earlier? Wasn't well, Didn't we already see that once? I don't know. Road signs. Ooh, I like the road signs. That's cool. Oh, these are... Oh, these are bonus rewards? Are these... Uh, are these past? No, this is this is rank one hundred, right? And what's next? No, it doesn't say. It doesn't. Say, oh, oh, here we go. So this next one is reach rank one fifty, and claim ninety. Oh, okay. So for this one, so to go over. Okay, so this is how it works. So to go over level one hundred. Oh no, to one fifty. Okay, so we have to go to rank one fifty to get these rewards. And claim all the other, you know, okay. That's a thing. So the bonus rewards. Who asked for surfboards? I don't know. Who asked for anything? 
So unlock this page to be able to claim. Okay, so we got, so these are just bonus rewards. So lunch boxes, perk, perk coins, legendary cores, legendary modules, re-rollers, score boosters. I mean, at this point, you really still need score boosters when you're this level, but scouts, banners. Okay, so those are bonuses. And that is the last page. Okay, well, so at least we have a list of all the rewards. So there's that. Going to call it the heavy incinerator. All right. All right, all right. Anyway, I think this looks pretty good. Uh, there's that. Okay, so yeah. that That's that. So cool. All right, something to look forward to. Awesome. So anyway, uh, this is it for me for the day. I'll be back on Monday. Mr. Epos, I'm assuming, goes live in some amount of time, probably in the next half hour, hour. Unless he fell asleep and stayed asleep, then who knows. But uh, this character will be back on Monday. And uh, we won't be doing the Vault Raid. We'll be doing other things because I want to do the Vault Raid next Friday. So we'll be doing other things. I think Mayor for a Day is on my list of things I want to do. I'll figure it out. I'll come up with something. I always do. So everyone have a good rest of your day and a good weekend. And I will catch you next time.